Paper Mario the Oregano King. So, before we begin, I want to read a chat message. Vinny, I'm here to tell you that I know this game sucks, even though I haven't played it, and I'm very disappointed in you for playing it for your own enjoyment. Real chat message. Welcome to the Toad Kingdom. As you can see, here's every character in this game, as legally allowed by Nintendo. Isn't this great, bro? Back on the road again, together, heading to some kind of festival. What did the invitation say again? An origami festival? What's that gonna be like? Oh Sound of a crash in the distance. Mario and Luigi never made it to the castle. The end. Mario, check the invitation again! Uh, when were we supposed to be here? You are invited to an origami festival in fabulous Toad Town. Date, whatever that is, Peach. Mushroom Kingdom has weird markings of time. Look at the <laughs> Luigi paper, that's good. Wait, is this Vine Realms? Luigi, you cheap! I'm always the one spending the money on you. Don't worry, Mario. I know just what to do in situations like this. You, you just gotta find Mario, right, Mario? <laughs> oh. Oh, okay. I, I'm just gonna take a deep breath and go find the key to this door. That's what you do, right? Tell Princess Peach I'll be right there if you see her first, okay? Bye-bye. Let's go. Bye-bye. Oh, good to see you. Shouldn't the Mushroom Kingdom unfold and be refolded unto glory? Is this a game over scene? I think if you say yes, it's game over, right? Yes. And what of those toads? Shouldn't they be silenced for all of eternity? Well, yes. I see. Last question. Will you crease yourself and be reborn like me? Sure. Ah, uh, I was hoping for a Far Cry situation where you could beat the game in five minutes. Those would have been fun speedruns to watch. This dungeon-themed waiting lounge is a huge upgrade from the last festival I attended. Very classy! Meow, come with us! Yeah, what's next? I've never seen a toad before. Please tell me it's a toad. Can you try to use it somehow? No! Oh, it's motion controls. My name's Olivia. You'd probably like to know a lot more about me and why I was trapped like that, huh? Fucking sure. Whoever you are. There's just one thing. I'm not exactly fleet of foot. Mind if I hitch a ride? Oh. In his pocket? Okay. I thought she was gonna, like, hitch a ride under his cap. Gee, Mario. This cap smells. You should put it in the washing machine. For those wondering, um, I won't be streaming too late tonight. Like, I'll be streaming this. I might be back later with more video game. But then I'll probably be ending the stream a little early. I have to go buy a bike at the dentist tomorrow, you know? Dungeons smell like this place smells, right? Just say it smells like your Ryan. We know. Scrub Lord liked your achievement? Why did I just get a message from that? The fuck? I've never seen that before. What is this shit? Xbox console companion. I didn't turn you on. Go off. Enable. Wow, Mario became a horror uh, genre. Royalty? Oh, nice to meet you. Is everyone in your kingdom also a face? <laughs> Folded Bowser is excellent right now. The way the way he moves, look, <laughs> look at the, the scuttle. This is a save point, Mario. Mario. Luigi, what's that pasta fazool? No, Mario, those are the testicles. You can use- you can fold them to save at a save point. Yes, Mario. Pasta fazool, Luigi! What kind of glands are those? Mario, if you press the B button, it will trigger the B action. Try it now. Oh man, I was expecting or hoping for like... some kind of like end game scenario... where they fold Mario. Mario. 
Lucario. Use the boot, Mario. Please. <laughs> what is this? This is like Final Fantasy IX cinematography. Thank you, generic shy guy. Can't even give him a hat. Oh shit, no! Canonically, this is, um, this will be Let Luigi's last appearance in any video game. I, I regret to inform you, I have an uncle that works at Nintendo. And, uh... It's true. Mario, you're destroying our paper environment. You don't have to do the sound effects, but I think they're kind of fun. That's my sound effects. All right, well, I already have more coins than Mario ever collected in his entire career. Yeah, no, they're not talking about, um, like, paper thrussies. So, no, it's probably not chat in the trees. Yo. Yo, guitar? <laughs> Boombox. What? Birdo. They're all shriveled. They need water to, like, get, like, uh, juicy. I forgot how- I forgot how to do the farts in this game. Please, please tell me how to do farts again, please. I don't know how to do the farts. I just- I want to fart. I just- I just- this puppy, puppy, me, puppy time. Puppy time. Please tell me how to do the fight with the puppy time. It's doing something. Watch out now. Oh. What? I didn't expect them to break out in song. Yeah. Wow. Big! I'm flat again! Thank you! Hello, Mario. <laughs> Maybe if you hit the seal, it'll get weaker somehow, and then you can take it down. Nope! Nobody bopity! You're just gonna leave that thing to eat some poor toad's house? Nope! I'ma save! I'ma go to World 5! The other end of the pipe is blocked. <laughs> no, you're not, Mario. Hey, I'm not the owner. I have a sample in the house. The first one's free. Thanks, now scram! Aw, oh, what have I done? Turtle T decreases running speed for a brief period of time. Oh, fuck. So, a lot of times when you see, like, an injured turtle, or what appears to be a dead turtle, they might still be alive. Yeah, they, they live through some shit. They can live a long time on low oxygen with, like, serious injuries. Welcome to Vine Sauce Turtle Facts, number one! Oh. Oh god, this is depressing. Alright boys, Red Shy Guy's back on the menu! Mario! Thank you! For saving the- <laughs> We all float down here, Toadleth. Mario, you wanna go cat raisin? No, from Nabisco! Cat raisins! Yeah, but you know Luigi would, would fucking take a deal like that. You you know he would... Like, he would be sponsored by, like, gamer chairs and shit, if he was a streamer. So anyway, here's this game Raid Shadow Legends! Everyone's playing it! I, I am, definitely! I love this game! L is dead, 2020. Do you think if Luigi died, he'd turn into a ghost like the Luigi's Mansion ghosts? That he, uh... And then Mario would have to, like, suck him up in the vacuum? Oh, fuck. Did Luigi jump the chasm? Have you seen this? Oh my god. <laughs> that was like Family Guy Yoshi. Oh, shit. Wow, that hole did more damage to me than any enemy in the game so far. Cheers, Mario. That was a right proper swing of the old hammer, innit? 
<laughs> Swing like that, a bloke would assume you're wearing some of them fancy accessories. Of course, I don't need to tell you about pressing plus to open up the menu to equip accessories, do I? A <laughs> bit weird. Weird little toad fella, huh? Little, uh, toady fella. It's a bit weird. Little, little toad fellas, yeah? By the way, Chad, did you see this? Hello, Mario. Feast your greedy eyes on the miracle orb. It dices, it slices, it purees, and it's one of a kind. That's a shell stone. I need it. Now, just calm down, folks. And then get excited all over again, because if you don't buy it now, you'll never have another chance. Let's start the bidding at 10,000 coins. Just 10,000 coins for this unique, absolute, necess necessary item. No. No takers, huh? I see, I see. Oh, we can't let this serendipitous situation go to waste. I've got an item. And once you've got coins... And you've got coins, so let's see if we can't make the magic happen, huh? Now then, this hurts me deeply, but I'm going to offer you the discount of a lifetime. For an extremely limited time, you can purchase this item. This fine item for the low, low price of 5,000 coins. We got a deal? No. I see, I see. Now, this is a slippery situation we've got to go over here. I'm looking to sell. You're looking to buy. Surely we can meet the middle. Just like your mustache. I'm just going to put this out there. 3,000 coins. That's it. That's the offer. Take it or leave it. Oh, boy. I didn't want to do it, but you're forcing my hand. At this price, it's as good as highway robbery. All we need is the highway and 2,000 coins. How about it? Eat shit. You're kidding me. You still don't want to buy it? I'm losing it. You want the shirt off my back, too? Take this thing away from me for... Thousand coins, will ya? I don't even want to sell it now. At this price, maybe I'll keep it. But you got me on the day my rent's due. My loss is your gain. 500 coins, take it or leave it. Oh boy, I was hoping it wouldn't come to this. The bank's gonna send me a letter. I just gotta get 300 coins out of this thing. At a minimum. Please, I'm begging you. Yes, sold for 300 coins. Take it and get out of my sight, you rascal. Now that's a deal. Wow. I scammed that mole. Desert paid 10,000 coins. Oof. Don't do it, man. Dang old fish. You want to help me out? I can learn you how to fish. Better, but let's see here. First, get a good old grip on them ZLLLR buttons and use LA for them fishies. I'm going to want to flick them to cast when you're ready. The harder you flick, the farther it goes. <laughs> Now, when a fish starts getting all interested, it'll just sit on their bed all day. It'll get nibbling. That's when you gotta be patient. Them fishies like to tease a little bit. Wait to get them good and then yank them on. What? Oh, shit! Can you, can you take it back onto the temple there? You just don't tell them where you found it. Then we get my little right back. Dong along rock back. Oh, no, the enemy's tiring. Oh my god. Blue streamer? Were that, <laughs> people are saying Ralph Bluton. Other people are saying it, it's Ninja. Alright, now we can just head inside, find the streamer, and what the fuck is this? Bunty come to Brazil! He interrupts their game, steals their ball, and fucking kills them. Yeah, the, I saw- I talked about the- the beta leaks, the Nintendo leaks earlier. There's one in particular where Yoshi... It's an early prototype from Mario World 2, Yoshi's Island. Where Yoshi gets hit and just, like, bleeds time. And Mario crawls around. If anyone gets me the clip, I'll show it. You got your baited. You got- you got your baited. <laughs> Haven't heard that one yet. It's probably not on YouTube, uh, chat members. Yeah, it's definitely... No, this isn't... <clears throat> correct, this is not a YouTube, um, clip. 
It's said that this claw-shaped gouge was created by the Earth Elemental in an epic battle. Mario? Hey, if it's really you, Mario, you've got to help me! Wait, what? <laughs> what? What the fuck do I do for this one? I don't know what to do for this one. Uh, will the hammer get these lads? Yeah, it will. No, it won't. Oh, no. No problem. I got this. The letter? It's, it's the smash invite. Paper Mario confirmed. Let me just say one quick thing. Be aware of your surroundings and please don't shake your controller too wildly. Fuck off! I play VR. I've knocked over bottles. Remotes. I've done so much stuff. It's fine. I can, I can deal with this. Turtle power. We have our own Zord. Turtle Zord acquired. Alright, you know what? I'm gonna dance it out! I'm out of coins, so I can't see the pretty lights anymore. I know I don't have to do this, but I want this Koopa to be happy. Yo, they're even- they even programmed the Koopa being happy! Thanks, Mario. I can't get enough of those beautiful lights. I'm saved, and now I'm gonna save you, Mario. Try pressing minus sometimes when you're in a pickle. Okay. Thanks, Tutorial Toad. Like, almost five hours in, Tutorial Toad is here to save us. Alright, shake it like a piece of outdated... ...photographic paper. How- how is this working? No, you're ripping me! There's gotta be a better way! You are tearing me apart, Mario! Uh... Oh, shit! Whoa. That was way too close. Oh, this is one of those shows about bad restaurants. Uh, let's open everything and investigate more. Right. Right. God, this place is fucking disgusting. I knew, then and there, that I had to get to the bottom of this. Tables on the floor. The menu was huge. The fish was raw. There was semen on the wall. Vinny, he doesn't know? What did I blind? Did I blind a Goomba? I chat's too fast. Chat, can you slow down for a second? So I can see where the Goomba is? Oh my god. Oh my god, I missed that?! Oh my god. Wow, I blinded three of those Goombas. So hard. We're right in the middle of the lunch rush when we got hit. Bang, eggs and rice flying all over. I'm telling you, the mess in here ain't our fault. We run a clean kitchen. This never happened. Chef! Chef, it's not my fault, Chef. Oh, it's not your fault, is it? Your menu has 50 items! Oh god, what is this chicken? Chef, that's from, uh, McDonald's, Chef. What? Yeah, we, we get the leftover chicken from McDonald's at the end of the night, Chef. How long has this been here? Three weeks, Chef. Three weeks?! What?! Yes, yeah, Chef, M McDonald's chicken, it lasts a long time. Chat, is this tower real? I really want to go here and have dinner on the roof. Vinny, it's in Brazil. It would be, wouldn't it? <laughs> I feel like I'm playing Metal Gear Solid. Oh shit. Nope. 
Hmm, is that the most powerful jump you can do? Oh man, you were almost out of the picture for good. The fuck? What the fuck? John Pencil. This guy is looking after a streamer, so he's a mod, says a chat member. Someone in chat just said, I fucking hate the Coomer chat meta. I don't know what any of that means. A barrel roll. Kill. Kill, do the kill. Punish time. Uh, no way. Defeated by a no-name, no-talent piece of disgusting pop culture. <laughs> you were better when you were a side-scroller, man. You should join us on our quest. We can help you recover your lost memories and make a ton of new ones along the way. What do you say, Mario? Wouldn't it be great if this guy joined? Wow, really? Gee, I couldn't put you two out like that. I mean, it is a kind offer, but... I don't even have any special moves. I'd just be in the way. I mean, I could probably be talked into it if you really wanted, but... Okay, never mind. You raised some great points. It's probably better for you to travel alone. Sorry to bother you. Have a good journey. Hey. Is that offer still on the table, you know, to uh, join you two? Because I, I might be considering it, joining you, that is, on your quest. With, uh, Mr... with, you know, with the cool stash and Big M. Your, your name was Mario, right? Uh, that sounds so familiar. I feel like some kind of pro at this adventure stuff. So, uh, can I join you, that is, please? No. Ah, uh, I see. Right, because I said all that stuff about being in the way. Yeah, I, I'd just be a burden. Uh, I get it, no hard feelings. I'm, I'm gonna nap a bit before we get to Autumn Mountain. Okay, so listen. I thought about it a bit more, and that floating lady have already invited me to join, right? Taking that offer back now would be really mean, and you don't look like a mean guy. So, here it is. Cards on the table. I would love to join you both on your quest. What do you say, Big M? No! <laughs> uh, okay. You must have your reasons. I'll just sit this one out some other time, maybe. Did I mention that I've lost all my memories? Sorry, I just wanted to make sure you caught that part. You've been very quiet. Which is cool. Don't get me wrong. Love the strong, silent hero type. I could learn a lot from you. Master and pupil, hero and sidekick. Fate must have brought us together. You can't deny fate, right? No. Sorry, was that no, I can't deny fate, or no, you can't join us? I, I should have phrased it better. <laughs> please, please let me join you on your adventure. I'm begging you. No. God dang it, Bobby. Oh no, I fucked up. Oh no, I fucked up again! <laughs> that was the perfect lineup? I don't know why I used those boots. That was a waste of boot. Boot, why you wait, boot? Wait, the amnesia must have sapped your memories and your brain power. How cruel. Someone said Olivia is a funnier... is like, funnier and... and uh, 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 annoying the Navy. What? Is funnier and less annoying Navi. Oh. Let's see, the label says, and nut. NUT! Yeah. Ah! Did we just leave Bobby behind? Never to be seen again. Let's head to that shrine, Mario. You know you're getting old when you reach for a water bottle and your back hurts. Not like anything bad, but... I just banned a chat member named Bottle of Water, is what I'm trying to say. Hey, Bobby. Bobby, it's me, your old pal. Uh, Teddy, was... It was awesome. It was awesome. Oh, 
<sighs> what? Oh, another new buddy. He doesn't look like those foldy guys, so that means he's friendly, right? Hey there, Stompy. I'm Babam. What's your name? Huh? He isn't saying anything. Oh. Bobby, no! I should have warned him about the paper macho enemies. Gotta get the loot first. Big M, ma'am, you saved me. I didn't mean to fall off that bridge. Honest, I, I said I wouldn't slow you two down. I'm sorry. Uh, why did you get the treasure chest first? I, I wish to insert the Goomba, but I don't know how to. Toads, you just kind of made it worse, though. Vinny, it's right there. I don't... <sighs> I think I just moved it back. Fuck. Bobby lived a hard life. <laughs> just, just lived a hard life. The game is called Paper Mario. Must be made of paper. Hello, Mario. Vine Sauce Bob here. Today on Paper Mario Origami King, I, Bob, uh, will be playing the game. Ah! I thought I had more stamina than this, but hey, at least it isn't raining. Also, yes, that is a very- I just- it just flew right over my head. Um, because I was focusing on the funny monkey, but that was a good Breath of the Wild joke. Oh, I think I've got it, Mario. <clears throat> more slide puzzles, eh? Vinny, you bought a puzzle game not wanting puzzles. Is this a puzzle game? <laughs> I, don't, I don't mind puzzles, I just don't like slide puzzles. Can't say I ever expected to see you stumble in here, Mario. We try to keep this place a secret. Long as we've got you here, Mario, you agree that Goombas are the strongest minions, right? <laughs> Keep dreaming, pal. Shy guys give 120% everywhere, every day. We're the clear favorites. Can it, you dorks. Sorry, Mario. These two are always going at it like this. Goombas and shy guys, Mario and minions, we're all pressed from the same pulp. Drink your coffee, bitch. I see. Just five minutes, chat. Five minutes. Give me five minutes on this puzzle. I got- I got this. I bet Uncle Funzalo could solve this puzzle in a second. Yeah, that- that, that guy was crazy. He was so good at puzzles and shit. Oh, man. I never saw anyone solve a puzzle as fast as- as Funzalo. Shit. That guy. I hate this. I knew. I knew what I was doing. Yep. Knew, oh, totally knew everything I was doing there. Didn't... Didn't solve it half by accident. Because that was all... Intentional. Uh, why are these water graphics so good? Mario's turn. Quite do what I wanted it to do, but all right, we'll figure this out. That was too many moves, huh? Screwed up. <laughs> Fuck. I thought I had another turn. And that was with a block. God damn, that sucked. Use the thousand fold arms I read from chat very late. Hmm. 
Mario live. Good live. What have I done? Oh no, I stepped on this first. <laughs> oh no! It's a little more anticlimactic, but it's it'll still work. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, that's that's no problem. <laughs> Look, Mario, it turned into another bibli bibliofold, just like the last one. Sorry, the Velemental is is deceased. Will it is no longer with us, but I can pretend to be the water Velemental. Oof, I actually feel extremely well hydrated. I'm- I'm- I'm overflowing! STAND BACK! Where is the little monkey fella? Me surrounded by weirdos. Me supposed to be at a party. You saved me. You helped me. Take the party. PARTY! The hell is this Goomba? Ungo? Is this an Unga Goomba? Well, that seems, uh, whatever disease this Goomba had, uh, we now have. Does that mean you can paddle that boat in the lake? Sure does. Did you guys need a ride down the river? I'd be happy to paddle for you. Free of charge. I'll be waiting at the dock. Come see me when you're ready. Uh, row by row. One thing. This old, old sculler. Nose. I, it's so slow. Life is good if you go with the flow. So there was a little toad fella who uh, became a monkey for a little while, loved canned tuna. Carl, what do you mean he liked canned tuna? Yeah, there's a little Goomba fella opened it up with his mouth. Grab onto something, folks. I won. Can, can we get that pre-rendered water back, please? Wait, it, it's all paper? Chat, this is your fault. This is, this is your fault. That I'm memeing to that specific meme. Chat's like that kid at school that introduces you to, like, pogs. And, like, smoking cigarettes in the bathroom. Chat is that kid at school that shows you, like, how to, you know, Pokemon cards. That's probably not a good analogy, never mind, but, you know. Don't do your homework, man! Nah, it doesn't even matter anyway! Hey, you wanna smoke some oregano behind the Wendy's? Did I ever tell you about that time my friend thought that green tea could get you high if you drank enough of it? And smoked enough of it? And then tried smoking green tea and realized it was a fucking horrible mistake. True story. But I'm an asshole because I ended up getting really into green tea at that time. And I was I was drinking lots of green tea, sometimes two cups of green tea a day. Or more. And I was like, I feel so relaxed. Yeah, sure. Unlimited pass to Shogun Studios, the best value. There's a progress stopping glitch in this area? Oh, lovely. You know, Mario, your dog has no tail. Paper Mario and the Origami King. There it is. I love the graphics in this game. Don't you? Man, the Switch is so powerful. Sometimes I feel like it's got better resolution than the original Game Boy. And I'm like, nah. Vinny, I find myself vigorously yelling in Mario's voice, how do I stop this? Y you just, you know, you just close your mouth. Let me see if I can do a Mario voice with my mouth closed. <laughs> I 
It's just Toad. Mario! See, now I'm doing it. What the hell? This is very important. You know what else is important? What, Mario? Nothing. No, Mario, I, I'm thinking you had something important to tell me. Nope. Nothing, Luigi. Don't worry about it. No, Mario, really tell me. You know, what is it? Is it something I gotta do? I gotta know? Mario, I... I didn't get a lot of guidance growing up from Papa Mario, you know, so... You, you gotta, you gotta take control here and, and, and tell me what I'm missing. I wonder if, um, Mario and Luigi's dad was like some kind of legendary bambino. Some kind of legendary plumber. I want to see that. I want to see the, the Mario game that takes place in the 40s. Like, uh, Papa Mario in, in, like, World War II. Fixing the pipe so that the Allies can win. Like he defected from Italy. <laughs> I don't know. Someone said in chat, defected from the Italians to the Japanese. Actually... Actually... Yeah, kinda. We've been playing musical chairs with our Zabutons. Zabutons? That's a kind of cushion used to sit on tatomi mats. Oh. Thanks, Toad. It's not Tatomi. What is it? What did I say? Uh, did I say it wrong? Tatami. Tatomi was. <laughs> Cats exist to um, consume our resources, us humans. Without quality armor, you're not gonna get some weapons. Meow out quality me armor. Meow weapons meow dune. I don't know. I really don't remember. Yeah, you're right. I don't remember what that that cat said. Heading do. Someone in chat just said my streamer fucked up the word zoo. Sorry, there's no ref uh, there's no refunds on the streamer, especially if the streamer is broken. I'll let you borrow it, but you might want to wipe it off first. But you have to wonder, why would anyone just give someone a used straw? Especially in this modern world we live in. In these trying times. Bank of America is here for you. Loyal to the Bank of America. Deep fried Twinkies. America, yeah, we're gonna deep fry them Twinkies, yeah. Soar like an eagle, fly through your stomach, come out as a piece of shit. Wait, is Bomb really, uh, sorry, Bombi really asleep? Bombi, please! Oh, yeah. Someone said that took me embarrassingly long to find. C I'll be honest with you. Under any other normal circumstances in any other video game, that would have taken me four years. I was fucking shocked at myself that I just found that. Jungle King mask. That's Big Kong energy. Space Warrior mask. An otherworldly mask. Sadly, it won't allow you to roll into a ball. I'm very happy that a Metroid reference was... ...snuck in the game. Hmm. There's something you don't see every day. Yeah, it really is. Uh, you know, it would be- it would be nice... ...if we could, um, see more of this. Maybe not every day, but close enough. Looks like he's firing beams from his hand. That's pretty cool, but not exactly Big M's style. It'd probably look perfect on some other kind of M, though. Fuck. Fuck off. Fuck you. You- you do not reference other M on this stream. You j you do not. Where's that person who works at Six Flags? 
That was like, Vinny, I can get you in Six Flags. It's open. Can you close the park for a day and then get me in? Note, I do not actually need someone to close the Six Flags park for me. This was a joke. I'm sure you're all aware of this. I don't know. I mean, it could be a joke. It, it could be correct. I don't know. I mean, this guy is very convincing. Uh, I don't know. Vinny, do you think toads get depressed? I think they do, yeah. Look at this one. How, how is this toad not depressed? Sleeve McDykel. <laughs> That's a good name. Uh, for those that don't know, this is, I think, from a, a fucking... What, what is this, from a video game? In the 80s? Of what... These... Of what uh, Japan thought American names were? Famicom? It's Famicom Baseball. Japanese baseball game. So, um... There's a video of reading these. Huh? And here come our players. Sleeve McDykel, <laughs> Willie Dustis, Hansen Sweeney, Jeremy Gride, Daryl Archidell, Scott <laughs> Dorkew, Anatoly Smorin, Joan Burkott, Ray McScriff, Dean Wesry, Glenn Allen Mixon, Mike Truck, Mario Mc <laughs> Mackerel Wayne, Dweet Rochigal, Raul Changerlin, Tim Sandale, Kevin Nogilny, Carl Dandleton, Tony Smerick, Mike Hernandez, Bobson Dugnut, and Todd Gonzalez. <laughs> that's Pro ZD, by the way. Good channel. But uh, that's fantastic. So, Sleeve is my favorite. Um, Scott is real. Sean, Sean is almost Sean. Dean, Mike, D almost Dwight, but Dwight, Dwight. Dw Tim is correct. Carl, Mike, Todd. Bobson is amazing. Tony's real. Kevin. Raul's fine. Mario's fine. Glenn Allen. I mean, I'm sure that's a real name somewhere. Ray from Star Wars. Anatoly is more Russian. Daryl. Onsen is, is also another weird one. Jerome. So, I mean, some of these are, are real close. That's the best part. They're just so close. Vinny, there's more? Oh, God, really? There are more. Oh, my God. Pot Corhill. Lude Janglosti. <laughs> oh, dude. <laughs> Hum Wapko, oh dude, Jorgudi, Earl Jivlets. Sorry, Jivlet, Jivlies. I like Jivlets better. Dan Boyo. Some of these are so good. Rar Dick, Call Blitzron, Marnell Hari. I think Bobson Dognut might still be my favorite. I don't know. You missed that one. One of the names is just Bob's. Anyone notice that? Some some call him Robertson. Yep. There's even more names, by the way. How many of these names? There's there's a lot of them. Ted Balloon. Oral. No Holland. M Moises Girardi. Well, there is a dude named Joe Girardi that was on the Yankees. I think he's their coach now, but I don't I don't really know. Mariano Breve, another well Yankee, Mariano Rivera. Dave Glark! Arm Starong is another good is another good one. Arm Starong. Here, have this. We really don't care about the signature, you can have it. Chat. I think we get Bigoron's sword at the end of this trade quest. Number 24. Blows's Gerardo. Number 24. Bingwell Johnstein. Number 3. Bingwell Johnstein. Number. 
33. Palvador Lonskunden. Number 33. I'm just... I can't stop making up fake baseball players. I love it. Ringnut Blunton... <laughs> Blunton Granfeld. Did he say unscathed? Does that mean it's dangerous in there? This whole thing sounds... <laughs> super fun! Solving puzzles, dodging traps, and escaping like a real ninja. I can't wait. Let's go in now. Can we go in now? I want to go in now! I just want to spend some time with Mario. I want to learn about... You know, the glands. And then I want to go home. That's it. I don't need to 100% this game. Oh, can't move somebody, anybody, preferably Mario, if possible, save me! It's like when you get the Frank caught in the zipper. <laughs> the, the Frank. It's- what's the Frank? Oh, it's like Mr. Frank. So this game is just a metaphor for Nintendo DMCAing streamers and YouTubers for using their- their content and- and playing fan games. I'ma go slow. I'ma go slow. I'ma wear a condom. Because it's responsible. I'ma go slow. I'ma take my time. Don't wanna get stabbed. And now Chrono Trigger. Oh, Final Fantasy VI as well, sure. And seven, a little bit. Or Mother Three. And Bob's and Doug Nuts Pro Baseball 1988. But no, truthfully though, I, I really don't know. Oh, this is my favorite trophy so far. It's just really tough for us to have like, you know, let's let's make a thousand or two thousand and just leave them because that's very expensive. Very expensive. It's toad time. Hey, who win? This is pet to win. Help me, Toad. We found 20, or you found 20 hidden ninjas, well done, perfection is within your grasp, just a few more. Your ninja rank is flippin' sweet ninja, Lois. Wait up! Hit bell 30 times for Toad? I don't know about that. This turret is sad. This turret is dead. Ten. No. Twenty. You weren't fucking wrong! My head is throbbing! Thank you, I think! I was told to hit it a thousand times. Hit it 100 times, but only after the boss of the area? Oh. Well, hang on a minute. I got a treasure. It wasn't Japes. Time to focus. Now we can rescue the other Toads and get rid of that streamer. Totally. I'm sure it's going to be exactly that easy. Oh. Cool. Cool. Cool.
We need a disguise, something to hide the way we look so we can walk right through that crowd. It'll work. Uh. Oh shit, it's not working. I don't know, I kind of like the idea of... ...pretending to be Samus. Just act normal. Everything here is good. It's, it's fine. Do you think that Toad's, like, hat... head... hurt thing hurts? Tragedy! The Fiend's pop gun has popped an innocent bystander. What's wrong, hero? Aren't you gonna save the town and us? <laughs> oh no, yet another townsperson has been knocked into next week. Whoa, partner, you're drawing too early. That's against the rules. The last townsperson has been whisked away. Oh wow, that really is lethal. Holy shit! The hero was quicker on the draw. It popped that outlaw to pieces. And so peace returned to the town. Thanks to Mysterious Lowman. Okay, goodbye. Ah, uh, big spike. The two villains down, peace has finally been restored. Yay! You took out my gang, but could you beat me? The tension is palpitating. Thank you, brave Lowman. Thank you, Mario. Sorry, Mario, we're not done yet. You better get back to your seat. We're the big rats who make all of the rules! Koopa time, Koopa time, go on for you! He's got sensitive eyes, a burly mustache, ni nice beefy calves to power those big jumps! Beep what beefy. Now I've got Mario Madness, and you're the only cure. <laughs> uh, you okay, Mario? I'ma die. I'ma pregnant! <laughs> Damn it. S sometimes I just... You know, sometimes I just want to, like, watch the show and not be the center of attention. Oh, yeah. I'm gonna spin. Ooh. I'm a graceful. Oh, shit! Everyone's alive. It was all just a show. The Elastic Entertainer Rubber Band. Oh, get out of here. Michelin Man's got some competition. Oh, your pitiful attacks have no effect on my bouncy body, except they did a lot, uh, you know. Wait a minute. Oh, f fuck. I want to thank the Toads for making this possible. Big damage. Doing some stuff here in my head. Donkey, donkey here. But it's cool. 
I can't, I can't help it. Why do I say that so much? The fucking video. All that's left is an onion ring. Did 40 damage with block. Those poor toads. Oh, no, they're fine. Mario aimed above them. That's good. I've been yeeted. Sadly defeated. At the hands of my rival. Uh, Pival. I'm now secreted. Not like banned as in, like, you know, rubber band, but like chat has been banned. That, that, that was what I was talking about. You know, we were just a rubber band, you know what I mean? That's why we made the album called Rubber Soul. So, the blue streamer has been... destroyed. I guess I'm the green streamer. Someone just said ninja gone. Well, there you go. Congratulations, blue streamer cleared. On the ninja level too, no less. Oh fuck, you're right. <laughs> what, what spines? They're made of paper, chat. I just thought of a good chat name, if any chat member needs a good chat name. Michael Stipe's voice crack. They told me I had tremendous cactus energy, I don't even know what that means. <laughs> the internet is bleeding into Mario games. But man, look at those Switch graphics, aren't they good? Look how good those graphics are on that Nintendo Switch. So, so powerful. You can almost see that that's Mario there. Almost. Oh shit, I should restart, because there's an update. I should restart, because there's an update for Animal Crossing 2? I remember. My missing memories, they all came back to me just now. Well? Who were you? Someone said head back to Shogun Studios and, and take a photo. Should I do that now or wait a little while? I'll do it later. You should do it now? Okay. Uh, chat is, is getting really weird about this thing at the photo studio. Either way, that's pretty deep and inspiring. Even a dud like me might climb up one of life's mountains someday. Is Bobby's character arc that he's a dud? And that... Like, his inner explosion needs to be found, so that he can explode and sacrifice himself for the team. That would be cool. I'm not looking at chat, I don't want to know, but I'm just saying. You guys were the best friends I've ever had. Well, you were the only friends I've ever had, but I've got to do this. I've got to do this. And then he explodes, and then he's just dead. It would suck, but it would be a good story element. I'm, uh, not broke, but I, that was a lot of money that I just spent there. <laughs> I just have a feeling that we're getting so close to- Ah, oh, your eyes are closed. Why is admission so expensive? Let me in! Let me in! Well, Eric Andre got into a fucking Paper Mario game. Hey, any writers for Paper Mario, uh, for Paper Mario, um, Cardboard Caper on Switch 2, can- can you throw in a quick Vine Sauce reference? That would be sweet. Thank you. Just throw it in. Just have, like, a greasy pizza, say something like spin. I don't know. That's fine. 
You don't have to, but Cardboard Caper is, is a game that I'm looking forward to. I've, I've already uh, seen the design docs for it. Or you could just have Sponge be a playable character. I won't ask for any money. For inventing <laughs> the Mario character that is sad and orange. <sighs> Vinny, 32 speen variations in 60 seconds video. Can you show it on stream? I've already seen this, by the way, but okay. On second thought, Nintendo, please never include a Vine Sauce reference in any of your games, ever. Spoon! Spoon! Alright. Spoon! Why did I do this? Spoon! Loud is funny! Spoon! 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 This was a mistake. Alright, thank you for that. Um, if you do another one, please don't have it ruin any of my ears. Any of my seven ears, please? Thank you, I'd appreciate that. Um... Is there music playing in this game right now? <laughs> my- I- I really had my volume way too high for that. It ends... now. Uh-oh! Ah, oh, shit! Oh, this stupid boulder won't budge. There has to be something we can do. Uh... You could just walk away. Oh. You know what you have to do, Bobby. You have to complete your character arc that I just talked about ten minutes ago. You have to do it. You have to do it, Bobby. God dang it, Bobby. Yes. It's the only way. I know how to save Olivia, Big M. We have to... Set sail! <laughs> we have to get to that port in Toad Town and set sail for the Great Sea. Listen, there's no music here, chat. You can't stop me. I want to just play some Wind Waker music for a minute. Not that anyone's complaining. In tune! Not that. That's it, Big M. That's the Princess Peach. <laughs> well, every now and then it works. I stole Desert's bit. I think we're equal then. We're even. Desert stole my idea. In the past. Well, sometimes you just gotta, you know, accept that you're gonna get cubes. I- I didn't say pubes. No. Though I did have a- a picture, I can't find it anymore. It was of, uh, clown pubes? Let's see, maybe I still have that somewhere. No. Yeah, I don't know where it went. I'm sure you could just Google clown pubes and get your desired result. Uh, I'm not responsible for what you may find after googling clown pubes. There we go. Thanks, Dave. It's a product. Someone probably made a decent amount of money with this stupid idea, too. Think of every, like, novelty store that you've come across that sells... Like little prank items, fake dog poop, etc., etc., and then they, you see clown pubes. You think about how many millions of units that shit sold, and how little it probably costs to manufacture clown pubes. Boop. Bobby, go! Damn it, Bobby.
Oh, this one lived. Do it, Bobby. Bobby! Rolling Stone says, Star Trek Lower Decks animated satire is highly illogical. Review, Star Trek Lower Decks broadly goes where no Trek has gone before. CBS is going to blame the fans. They didn't drink enough before watching the show. It's, it's their fault. We sent them alcohol. We don't know why they didn't enjoy our show. <laughs> I talked about it last night, like, uh, it's a common thing to do, so I'm not saying that this was, like, highly illogical, but, you know, they sent... There's pictures of reviewers that got sent, like, a care package for Star Trek Lower Decks, and it was just booze. It was, like, Star Trek-themed booze. But, not entirely uncommon. You know, sometimes networks do try to spice up the package a little bit with like a, you know, like a press package. You give the reviewer like a little gift. It happens with games. A lot, actually. It happens with, with movies, you, you know, you name it. Shit. Mario doing his best Bobby impression. Vinny, are you saying you don't want to see Pickle Picard? I'm a wop. Turned myself into a pickle. You know, Jean-Luc, it's quite a pickle. You're in. Ah! Oh! I'm gonna go make a pizza. Vinny the mushroom. What mushroom? <laughs> Did I miss a mushroom? In the other room? Here? I don't see the mushrooms. It's long gone. Oh, okay. It was when the enemy exploded. I walked right past it. What the fuck did I blind there? Season 7 had some really fucking clunky episodes. Some great ones, too. But Beverly Crusher, the doctor of the ship, has sex with a, a Scottish ghost in space Scotland. Would I? Well, Dan Aykroyd did, so... maybe. I gotta ask Dan Aykroyd what his experience was like. Well... I was drinking some Crystal Head Vodka. Oh, shit! Bobby, you gotta do it! I screwed up, Bobby! Thanks, Bobby. I used to dream of being a ship captain. Or an admiral. I bet I'd be a pretty cool admiral. Like a... Admiral Bobbery? The pictures in the back are Peach from ever, every Paper Mario game. Oh, that's cool. They acknowledge the old games. Is this happening? I'm shocked that Bobbery was even mentioned. You know, because it was a modification of the original Babam, which is now illegal! And therefore... Shocking that they'd even mention Admiral Bobbery. Well, they didn't. It wasn't really even a mention. Never mind. It just was the word Admiral. Do you think toads are like a delicacy in various parts of the Mario Kingdom? Or the Mushroom Kingdom? Do you, do you think like... Like their hats or their heads or whatever the fuck those things are? I'm not really even sure. Like the lore is confusing because in the Mario Brothers cartoon show, Toad clearly takes it off. And it's a hat. Oh no, it's already here. That's the door to the VIP stateroom. Hurry, get inside! I'ma go this way! No, you're not, Mario. I don't see it. Oh my god. 
Ellipsis Vinny. Vinny Ellipses. Someone said, I love the irony of Vinny being bad at spinning people around. Spin in the place where you were. Quick, the VIP stateroom is through that fancy door. Nope. Nah, no, I'm gonna go this away. I put it in this lockbox to keep it safe. Oh, what was the code? Come on, brain. Think. Think. The code. Holy shit. Do you really need that box? We have to get that box back. That monster's probably on the ship's bow. Let's chase after it. Oh, he's pissed. We now have a murder bob -omb. Time to fight the Kraken and see if thieves. Nope. Don't ink me, bro. Oh my god. Those toads were in there that whole time. It's the Skunjili man. A bomb got a super important Olivia saving item. Okay. Now he'll be able to rescue Olivia. Gee, I wonder what it could be. Thank you, Mario. I'm the captain of the Princess Peach. It was dark and scary inside that beast, but at no point did I sob fully and uncontrollably. Any fibs that think otherwise are just that dirty mutinous fibs. Toot -toot. That ship was full of passengers, but we helped them escape in lifeboat to preserve customer satisfaction. I hope all our passengers are safe out there on the Great Sea. Toot -toot. Toot -toot. Uh, is there anything else on the ship that I missed? No. Mario! We need to rescue the passengers that abandoned ship. There's too much fog out on the Great Sea. If you see that the fog is lifted, will you come and let us know, please? Toot toot. This fog is incredible, eh? Can't move forward if you don't know which way you're going. Without quality armor, mere weapons, mere. I read that as. I read that on a twist off cap once. The bottle of juice was so wise. Most of my lessons in life have been learned from... Um, bottle caps, actually, yeah. And Bazooka Joe. I don't even remember the specific cat quote from Trials of Mana. I think it's... W mirror without quality mirror Mirror without the ripper. Without quality armor, it won't matter how good mirror weapons are. Not a lot of RPGs where you just sit to regain health. I mean, Final Fantasy VII Remake and now Paper Mario, but most of the time you have to sleep or drink some kind of tonic. Mario could just sit for three seconds. There's no time skip. I'm tired, I'm a sit. Oh, Hollow Knight. I forgot about that. Hollow Knight. But in this case, I oh, don't worry about Olivia, she's fine. Um, in this case, Mario could just sit down on the grass for three seconds and he'd get full HP. Why doesn't he do this? Why do you not do this? Vinny, it's not an RPG. Well, you play- you play the role of Mario in this game. It's not strictly an RPG. It doesn't have the same progression, unfortunately. Which I think is the one thing holding it back from being really, truly great in my mind, but... You know, there's- there's role-playing. More adventure. I mean, RPG is such a broad term these days anyway, I don't even really know... You know... It's the first origami-type game. I'll tell you everything. A while back, I was traveling aboard the Princess Peach with my buds, my b rads <laughs> and my friends. We had all pitched in to share the VIP states room. Now, sure, some of us had to sleep on the floor, but... The open sea, the salty breeze, it was the best trip ever. But then that monstrous blooper attacked the ship. We did our best to defend Peach, but... The Peach, but it was too strong. That's when it happened. My fuse got knocked loose. It flew right off the boat, and so did I. Next thing I know, I'm in the Great Sea. 
Not sure what happened next, but I washed up at Toad Town. No fuse, no memories, no clue. So I went off. So off I went, lost and alone on a journey to try and remember, well, anything. That's where you and Olivia came in. And then those fireworks that we saw together at the Shogun Studios. They made me remember. The fight with the blooper, my fuse, my buds, boom! Everything came back to me. I'm so glad my memories are back, I remember everything now. Including a way to rescue Olivia. See, I had a lot of buds, but I lost my bestest bud. Bestest best bud a long time ago. He got scrapped in an accident. His name was... Also, Babam. <laughs> Olivia would have had such a hard time telling us apart. I always kept his fuse with me to remember him by... Until the amnesia hit. So it just sat where I left it. In that VIP states room on the ship. State room, rather. Big M. If I can save a friend like this, it means I finally become the sort of Babam I always wanted to be. That's what every Babam hopes for. A chance to change something for the better. To make an impact. Big M, uh, I... I had so much fun traveling with you and Olivia. It's been... a blast. <laughs> Sorry, I'm kind of nervous. Thanks for the fuse, best bud. Thank you, Mario. For everything. No, you son of a bitch, no! Wow, okay. So, as I predicted, but, um... Wow. That, thanks, man. What happened? Did you save me, Mario? Thank you so much. Getting flattened hurt a lot, but now I'm back to my folded and fancy-free self. Wow, the whole rock is just gone. Blasted into confetti. How did that happen, anyway? Did you get some kind of dynamite hammer or something? Just kapow, or what? Wait, huh? Where, where's Bobby? Is he around? D don't tell me he missed all of this. Uh, M Mario? Wait, did he? There was a loud bang and now the rock is gone. No. No! It can't be! Well, this is more story than I expected. Someone said, sorry, I just came back from a break. How's our favorite bob -bom doing? Fine. Bobby's just resting. Important box. Oh no, it's the box. It's the big idea. I'm digging here. How'd you like it if I came down to your work and put on some overalls and... Wait, what do you even do? <laughs> you got me. You saved me. I was just pretending to work. Yay, Mario, my hero. Look, if I give you something, will you just go away? Wow. That's it! I got nothing else for you! Bobby sacrificed himself for me. No, now he's gone. How? How could he do that? I, I don't know how I can go on. <laughs> Maybe they're really committed to this. It's not just gonna be like a C-3PO situation. They're gone? They're gone? Big M. <laughs> Listen, Olivia's having a hard time with this whole thing. If she doesn't pull through, it's like everything we did was in vain, or I did was in vain. 
But Big M, Big M, if anyone can cheer her up, it's you. Just think what you could do to... What could you do to put a smile on her face? They say that laughter is the best medicine, right? So maybe you could make her laugh. I just want to say... One... Two things. One, no one's ever really gone. And two... Hey, Mario! It's me, Matelo! Your friendly bub ghost! <laughs> so dumb. <laughs> Damn it. No, oh, that's not fair, Mario. Stop trying to force me to laugh with that. Wow, I felt an emotion, chat. Um, yeah, I mean, if... I, I guess Bobby's really gone, which is... Two things. One, I'm surprised they had the balls to kill a character that I actually think is, like, actually... Pretty good. I, I enjoyed Bobby as a character. Even though Bobby just looked the same as every other goddamn bob -omb. But... There's also this idea of, um... It really speaks to the fact that... bob Have a hard life. And then, then it just ends. It's a short life. So now, I'm never gonna add a bob to one of my Mario Maker levels again, if I ever make a Mario Maker level again, because I got real lazy with it. If anything, it just makes Bowser more of a villain. He does not give a single fuck about these bob Oh! <laughs> so, like, what if... You know, Mario gets married one day, and... You know, has to make a baby. Is Bobby gonna just be there? Like... I like the way you thrust, Mario. Like, that's not... cool. Nice form. God, that, what a fucking shitty afterlife that would be. Well, do you see? Nope. Nope, this is real. Now, when I was doing research for the movie Ghostbusters, I stayed at a haunted hotel, you see? And, uh, I had a sexual experience with a ghost. I mean, look up Dan Aykroyd's interview about his sexual experience with a ghost. You think Dan Aykroyd would, would lie? He's an actor. Well, that's why we called it Crystal Head Vodka. You know, you, uh, <laughs> you can't give good skull. <laughs> Alright, folks. Thanks for watching. I'm done forever. Good night. And you will be glad you came along when you see the kind of value we off we are offering here today at Toad's Otomo Boots. Feast your eyes on the boot car type B racer. It eats up desert terrain like a tourist at a buffet. And when you hit that turbo button, who we better hold on to your mustache, cowboy. Now, the least I can do is offer you a no coins down test ride. By accepting this whistle, You've agreed to the terms and conditions of our not a least lease. Boot car. Just blow the whistle and their car came tearing out nowhere, take you where you want to go. Just stick to the desert, okay? Those tires aren't rated for other types of terrain. No need to read or understand the details of your not a least lease. If the shoe fits, drive it. Hop on in. Looking good! Now, I'm sure you know how to handle a fine vehicle like this, but let me just give you the pointers. Use L to steer if you want to blow the hairs on your mustache back. Hold ZR to hit turbo. Keep that button mashed and you'll be moving fast enough to break stuff and take out the fold of soldiers. Just, uh, mind the paint job, okay? Artie! Marty, we've got to go inside the cartoon, Marty! Well, there are at least three rays of lights over there, Mario. Maybe even four. There are four lights! 
Why is this music so good? Bro, I'm vibing so hard with this music. It's like I'm totally oblivious to everything else. Bro, I'm incapable of embarrassment. <laughs> A superpower, some would say. She's in to superstition. Black cats and voodoo doll. To make you think you're crazy when you're dancing in the rain. I've missed 10 straight continental breakfasts. You think that's bad? I miss every free be breakfast in every hotel I ever go to. Hello, Mario. Someone just said, I just realized that Mario is currently in a hotel. It's time to fill a baby dance. I wanna fill a baby dance. Yeah. I, I, did I, wait, did I pass the toddler check, or did I fail miserably? I needed their help, so I failed. Uh, I see now. For future puzzles, I'm smarter. Someone said being an adult means solving problems with your wallet. <laughs> it's time to solve the puzzle with the baby toddler games. If you can use the baby games. Vinny, are you okay? Vinny, are you okay? Boom, ba doom, boom. No. Vinny, are you okay? I was actually here for a conference on investing. Something about the pyramids in the area. Ah, but you don't want to hear about that scheme. Here, take this. Just a small token of my gratitude. No, mate. No, it's an inverted triangle. No, it's not a scam. It's an inverted triangle. Blah. Blah. Blah, blah, blah. Well, I can get one of these. And I am poor. It turns out that the ridiculous amount of money that one gets in this game actually is used. Yeah, let me just spend all my coins. It's time for baby time. It's time for baby time. Baby time. Oh. Talk shit, get hit, I guess. Hmm, yes. It seems the ancient rituals were observed correctly. Well, you can read that writing? Well, of course. I'm a professor of ancient studies. This is written in the language of the ancient ones. Studying it is my life's work. Captain Tiaud? Like, am I saying it right? Is it Captain Tiaud or Captain Tiaud? But we've got a complicated problem, too. That streamer in the desert. Yeah, desert. Step right up, step right up. You could win 10,000 coins, and it only costs 100 coins to enter. The rules are simple. You must simply guess. My sniffitly mood. You will have three tries. Are you ready? It's as easy as reading my face. <laughs> are you sure about your answer? Is, is this really a Who Wants to Be a Millionaire reference? Rest in peace, region. Is that your final answer? The game only costs 100 coins to begin, but losing costs your freedom. Please kindly make your way to the freedom containment chamber without any fuss. As a consolation, you will share the space with any previous contestants for all eternity. There is one other option. You can try again, but this time it will be 1,000 coins to play. Do you want to try? Nope. Really? Even though I'm about to take your freedom, that means game over, pal. No. Very well, thanks for playing. Oh shit. M Mario?
Oh. Is that your final answer, baby? How'd you do that? Oh, gee, I don't know. That was fucking highway robbery. Look over there! Luigi can stay in there for a little bit, in the Freedom Containment Unit. I don't mind. He doesn't mind either, I don't think. He's used to it. Is that... Is that number 69? What? That... that... fucking... tower... was number 69. That was intentional, right? In in a bedroom, no less, too, by the way. It's in a bedroom. A sensual, dimly lit bedroom. They could have easily... Someone could have easily on the team just stopped that from happening and said, No, make it number 65. What are you doing? Someone said maybe just... We're all just obsessed with dicks. I'm... Listen. Okay. That... Looked... A little bit like a peem peem So, I don't know. I I'm not so sure. It's just, like, us seeing things that don't exist. Vinny, that was Luigi's bedroom. No? Yeah, okay. So, no, but he didn't- he- that's not his luggage. That was in there already. Oh, can you hear me? Are you there? Are you- it's- it's- it's a fucking J-pop song. Wow. Are you there? Fire's burning in my chest now! It's a flame! I call your name! I wanna see you in the pulp now! Let's all rise up! Join together! Fire temple time. I knew that. I knew that too. It's playing it now in Babby Reverse. God damn it. Brain. Do something impressive for once. Oh my god. The oh fuck, why can't I do this? Oh, this is this Babby game still? What? Chat, shouldn't the confetti just burst into flames in the air? It's okay, it's paper. Okay. Oh my god. Alright, um, now I'm in trouble. There's a bench right here. Oh, god damn it. I was like, what is that object? Oh, it's a bench. How are we not dead? Oh, wait, 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 wait. That only uses- oh, okay, never mind. I see. Enemy is out of range for that attack. Oh. Vinny, can you tell us your favorite joke? My life! I... I used to think it was a tragedy, but now I've learned it's a comedy. I just want to hear what Tommy Wiseau would... Like, how would he deliver that line? I used to think life was tragedy. There's gotta be a, a way to get him to... Well, he already did the Joker. Never mind. He was the new Joker. He was uh, Heath Ledger Joker for a bit. It's Phoenix from Final Fantasy VII, or Moltres, or any other Firebird in any- anything. I hope I have enough HP for this. I really, really hope that this is the end. <sighs> Not quite. God damn it. I might die here. Oh, man. 
I didn't even have a one-up mushroom either. The babbiest of all the babby games. Bintor, why you fail at babby game? I don't- I don't know. Vinny, why? I don't know. Then we can smash. No? Oh, because it needs the feathers to be off. Vinny, no? Bintor is not doing very well. Bintor is not paying enough attention, either. That's a big toad. Alright, I'm full health. Uh, hopefully, hopefully it was worth- that was maybe too much money spent on the toads, actually. Why do you do that? I didn't realize this was the end! I thought I had another spin. Need those big iron boots. I was like, what happened? Why did it stop? It was a scripted event. Okay, okay, okay. Rip spicy chicken. Wow. Spicy chicken is reborn. Yes, father! Dad, did you, um... Did, were you in VR again? I smell gas! Did you turn the oven on? Yes, Tucker. My son. To be continued. This is where the next season of Vine Sauce picks up. This is where they introduce the child character, and the show, the ratings tank, and no one watches the show anymore. And like, every episode, there has to be some kind of, like, learned lesson. So we've run out of things to talk about on the stream, huh? So now I'm just talking about beards. I, I, how fucking powerful is... Toad Explorer? How am I eating this much shit on these puzzles? <laughs> Total kill. Total. All but one. Total. Annihilation. Kill the last pokey for 10k coins? Oh, that's good. If that's real, I mean, we've- we've arrived at this thing while we were playing Risk of Rain last night. That even if all of chat says a thing, it doesn't necessarily mean it's true. I had to rev the engine. Okay, that was real. Somehow this is Professor Toad's fault. Professor Toad is just better. Can I just play the game as Professor Toad, please? Oh, fuck. I just did not see that at all. Whoa! Eat dick! Someone said it's so refreshing to see a man toad. What? Why? Why is this for- what? It 
sacrifice the professor for more confetti. Well, it's not a bad idea. I could rip them up. Oh, yeah! Destroy the species! What? <laughs> nope! It's a little weird. It's no weirder than Indiana Jones having no face in the uh, Nintendo Mario show. Vine sauce Bob in chat. Who who were you previously? You've been here for quite a while, so I have to wonder. You snagged the Vine sauce Bob name. At least Vine sauce Toad has uh, solved the problem. There's uh, now there's a Vine sauce Toad in chat. How, how long have you been here? There's no way you just made that name. So you've had that for a while. You can just change your name on Twitch easily. Can you really change your name on Twitch that easily? That it takes, like, less than 10 seconds? Yes, but you're stuck with it for a few months. Is it worth it for the meme? Don't answer that. I know the answer. <laughs> this is really disturbing for a Nintendo baby game. Sounds like Mario Kart music. I hate it! The song was overplayed the first time it hit the airwaves. They tried to make us love it by putting it on high rotation, but I'm not gonna fall for that, no way. Loot the best five seconds, put it in car commercials, and throw the rest in the trash. I'm done with it. Damn. Vinny, you're streaming this part on vinyl record day. Good coincidence. All right. This one goes out to all the terrifying monsters in the house. Let's get into it. Fuck yeah. I hate it! Okay, okay, yeah, I can see why people like this song, but it's not just not for me, you know? Alright, this one goes out to the terrifying monsters in the house. I HATE IT! What am I, a tap dancer? The tempo's way too fast on this track. Drop the RPMs, or better yet, drop the whole album in the dumpster. Ooh, I like that. No thanks. Alright, here we go. Now that's groovy. Oh, that bass line's making my body do things I never dreamed possible. I'm ready to get down. Wait, 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 wait. I'm not gonna be the only one there getting loose. Why is this place so dead? Who killed the mood? I'm not gonna cut a rug unless everyone's cutting a rug, dig? Wait, 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 wait. Maybe we can get those faceless toads to help. They'll dance to anything, right? There's actually a cut song that's even closer to Thriller in the game files, really. Oh my god. This is pretty thrilling. I just want to hear a little bit more of it. Though someone said something rather bizarre I'd like to address for a moment, because um, it, it both made me laugh, and also I'm, I don't understand it. Okay, they, they said um, there's a comment that Mary found. Is there a way to know when a video of Xenoblade is going to be uploaded? I would like to stop getting this game spoiled to me every day. 
So I'm very confused by that comment because that the Xenoblade chatless streams are uploaded once a week, if that, sometimes once every two weeks, and you you don't have to uh, watch the video. So I, I don't know. I hope that dude found a way to not watch videos. Um, was he was complaining about spoiler being in the thumbnail, but it wasn't even a spoiler. No, it was just an it was a, an a, a, an enemy design, really. So, I don't know. I mean, whatever the case is, I, I don't like spoilers. I, I don't- I want to help mitigate that if possible, but... Single color thumbnails? I'm all for it. D dude, there's how many shades of colors are there in this world? So many. You could use a different shade of teal every day for the next two years and still have more. Millions? Oh, we're good then. Get out on the dance floor with those faceless freaks and our special guest, Mario. Hello, Mario. Chad, did you ever buy floppy toothpicks by accident? Sorry, I'll stop. Let's- let's continue watching. This game has four people credited to it for dance choreography. The fuck? I dig it. Hey, Chad, this is an underground area. Dig. It's groovy. Seeing as there's no sun to rise in here, that means this groove is never gonna end. Hey, come on. Hey, come on. Come on. You wanna dance? You wanna dance, bro? Let me show you what you're up against. Huh? One, two. All right. Bro. Uh, did you just half my HP? Oh my god. Holy shit, Mario. This is the equivalent of a Paper Mario lobotomy. Please let this work. I didn't even look at chat. I'm just trying to figure it out on my own. Hopefully this works. Please, turt, work. Turt, work. Turt, work. At least Mario's been made whole again. Make us whole again, Mario. That wasn't great, but we're defended, at least. He's dancing dirty, said a toad. Make us whole again, Mario. Roadhouse... Wait, is... is... Wait a minute. Is Roadhouse a Family Guy reference? This is Toad House now. It is? When... really, when does... what's the context of it? Peter Roundhouse kicks people and says Roadhouse over and over. Oh. <laughs> Vinny, this is desert. Oh, it is, because the yellow streamer is desert. That's right, I'm the green one. Alright, I'll take care, desert. Have a nice afterlife. So wait, who are the streamers again? Chat, what did you arrive at in terms of- So I'm the green streamer. Desert's yellow. Ninja is blue. Red? Who's red? Mike is purple, that makes sense. Jerma? It, 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 chat is just picking their favorite streamers now. <laughs> chat, purple could be Twitch chat. That could be you. You're all streamers. I told you what people say. So, uh, you know, do your streamers like the games you play? Each streamer is Toad. Just like Midgar, the desert has been ruined by sunlight. It's a nice chord. What chord is it? Seventh?
we got? Sorry, I just I get it. I get my rocks off like that. That's that's how I get my jollies going. Someone uh, posted this image in chat before in regards to spoilers, and it's been on my screen for the past ten minutes or so, or more, twenty minutes, and I'm just like, what the fuck? Spoiler thumbnail. Oh god. Welcome, welcome, Mario. Vinny, what? Well, I already did this. The lamp scam thing. This is- I've been- I did this already. Make the funny joke with the 3D dots. Do the 3D dots. I make the name with the ellipses after because it is very funny joke. Then we spam all the night. All day. All the night. To boot the ellipses. Chat. Ellipses. The MC to I couldn't make it work. I tried. I could sing in that dude's voice for a Red Vox single. I'll call it the end of a non-existent career. <laughs> Allow me to introduce myself. I am indeed the Toad, known as Ode, Captain Teod, to be precise. I have survived the interminable passage of aeons here in this Arctic prison, and now I am free. Captain T. Ode? Of course, Mario Olivia. I think he means Captain Toad. There's one thing that has us completely stumped. How do you take your coffee? Cream and three sugars. Three sugars! It's beyond my wildest imagination! Ah, uh, Mario, thanks again for helping with that nasty business back in Shroom City. I owe you one. Please feel free to pick up the, uh, feel free to pick these up at your leisure. Holy fuck. If only they were true, a sea chard like that might help us cut right through this blasted fog. Ha ha ha, y'all jokers. That might be the most ridiculous fear I ever heard. You met a legendary captain from ancient times, and he's just hanging out in the dusty old museum. Ha. Tall tales around here. I don't know why this toad is from the south, but... It's a little spice on the personality. Yeah, drive 80% of the way there, then learn you can press B. Yes. Yeah. Sorry I'm late. I think I heard everything while I was running in. You want to get that rig to the Great Sea, I'm your toad. <laughs> I'm just so excited that you all have called on me and my boat to help. I don't know what this voice is. I can't wait to see what that submarine can do. Going under the water? What will they think of next? <laughs> anyway, I'm ready when you are. Vinny, I don't find you all that loud. If you watched my Xenoblade uh, episode recently, which again, some of you don't want it to be spoiled, and or just have no interest in watching only some of an RPG. But I, I talked about how... If you watch my highlights only, you might get one impression, because a lot of it is just, like, loud hyena laughs and... Like, NO! Like that. Because those are the moments that people enjoy and clip the most, that have the most views, that have the most, like, suggestions and timestamps, or that the editors like. Well, that's fair. But then, like, level two Vinny is watching the streams for, like, a four-hour period where you're like, oh, okay, this dude isn't always loud. Wow, he talks a lot about Star Trek and Led Zeppelin. Um, and then... Then level three is my music. Where, where you're like, oh, okay, then I, I see. There's a little bit more to this dude. And then level four is actually knowing me in person. Level five is, is my own scummy brain. Level six... is the super position. That's the astral spirit self. That's like... Somewhere in, in the, the, the cosmos from before I was born and after I died. And then level seven is when we all become one with the universe. It's also known as Terminal Seven. I feel like I'm one with everything, Mario! Uh, if you want to reach level seven, it'll be $300 a month. Um, and the meetings are every Tuesday. This really is Dr. White. 
This is like his aesthetic, Dr. Wily. Dr. Wowie. It's like when you boil a potato too much and then it becomes an under potato. So I want to tell you about the floppy toothpicks, chat. I bought a, um, a, like a travel toothpick thing, and the toothpicks are really flimsy and, like, kind of floppy. All right, Mega Man, here's where Dr. Wowie lives. You must recover all the dreamers immediately, Me uh, Mega Man. When we find that Swewa, we'll find Dr. Wowie. Okay, Vinny, but what the fuck is an under potato? You can't just not explain it. No one in chat explained it? Nobody knows? What? Is this a Staten Island thing? Chat, do you want to know the secret of Yoda's hut? Perhaps? I hear there's a... an urban legend about the Jersey Devil and them woods there. I... I guess it's Kentucky JFK, sure. Have you heard the legend of the... under potato? Whoa, it's so fast! Yeah, bitch! Vinny, literally no one in chat knows what an under potato is. It has to be a Staten Island thing. Please explain. I might go insane. I was hoping someone would know so I wouldn't have to explain it. Real fake bushes. Aw, oh, it's a dick clam. I, I, oh, you can't jump on these normally? This is fine. Wait, no, it's not fine. Do you know how when you, when you boil food and like you have it like like almost like a soup or a stew and some of the stuff closer to the heat gets overcooked that's under potato it's also like from under cheese it's kind of like that too someone said i missed the explanation no oh, it's a shame it was a good one too is under potato like over corn yep side beef it's not quite side beef no i think your hp just increased again mario and you seem stronger to boop Thanks, Toad. I never thought it did. Vinny, it's pretty werewolves of you to not explain Undertato. Undertots. Well, it's werewolves of chat to assume that I ha Oh! If I'm not careful, chat, I might accidentally fight Emerald Weapon early. Without underwater materia. Well, these aren't real bloopers. So I guess you could say it's not a blooper reel. You know what, chat? Fuck. You. Chat, my jokes are really funny. I know because when I tell them, people don't laugh out loud. And in Japan, that's a sign of respect. <laughs> I uh, steam clams. I thought they were called under potato. That's a Staten Island expression. My friend and I promised to meet here in case of a huge disaster. I wonder where they are. Your friends are dead. I mean, they're unfrozen. Do we have a spare handle? Yep. That's creative, but definitely not what this door needs. I think it might be on the other side, which I, I can get through if I had a handle on the situation. Ah, oh, come on, come on, come on, come on, please. No, come, come on, come on. No, 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 I, I, come on, you don't, you don't want to do the Muppets anymore? Come on, come, come on, that wasn't that bad of a joke. You're not even the real Fozzie, you don't even sound like him. Well, I mean, neither do you on the new Muppet programs. I mean, I, I don't know what the hell kind of voice that is, Kermit. It's poor Muppets. Trying to stay relevant, taking my ideas and becoming influencers. And I'm, I'm definitely enjoying playing it. Also, speaking of pee-pee poo-poo, I opened XSplit, and this is what I saw. And if you were here last night, you know why this is like this. I'll give you a hint. Get ready, because it's coming on the 31st. Goblins, ghosts, and witches, we got- It was Captain Lou. I was confused for a minute. I was like, what is this fucking diarrhea on my screen? 
Oh, yes, steamed clams. Sorry to invoke the meme, but it, this is exactly appropriate. That's weird, you're naked. Club Island. Vin, you gotta come to my cousin's Club Island. I think Green Toad might be my favorite character in the game so far. Yay, thanks Mario, you've been a big help. I know you'll keep being a big help by making sure my three friends make it out of the grass to join me. Yay, my three friends are out in all that tall grass. Thank you, thanks for offering to bring them here. Yay, <laughs> fuck you Green Toad. I hate Green Toad now. The four differences of Toad. The four stooges. The Beatles. Hey guys, take a look at this game. This island is shaped like a crescent moon. I'm a bit of a lunar calendar buff. Vinny, he said croissant? Croissant moon. Oh. Oh, he did. He did say croissant. Hi, can I get a croissant, please? Meanwhile, it's croissant. Yo, can I get a croissant? What? Vinny, don't think too hard. Am I overthinking this? I have to pay toads. Because I don't- I don't see the solution. Babby puzzles. Holy shit, Babby puzzles. How embarrassing. Whoa, this looks bad. Hang on, friend, I'm coming. Wait, what's happening? What are they doing, these weirdos? What- are, what is this? Hey, I'm in a real pickle here- here- Hey, I'm in a real pickle here. Here. Donkey by the pool. It's like hot under potato. No, the, the more unoriginal aspect of this game is just the toads. <laughs> and they're funny! I like them! But they're all toads. But we already know why they can't do that. Miyamoto actually goes to the office of the people who do that, and he just stares at them sternly until they change the thing into a toad. And that's enough. Miyamoto has quite the stare. You don't want to fuck with Miyamoto. Miyamoto would change it himself. Aonuma has said Miyamoto will literally modify games against the wishes against his wishes, and he has to undo the changes. I, I like to think of Miyamoto as this dude that just lurks from office to office when you're not at your desk, and like, he'll spend an hour changing like 40 things in a game with his own assets. Like, he knows how to program every game, he's kept up with every single advancement at Nintendo, and he just walks over, gets in there, changes your work, and then you won't even know it's him. They had to, like, set up cameras to find out that it was him, otherwise they thought it was, like, computer gremlins. Chat, what if Miyamoto himself leaked all the assets? From the, the mega leak over the past couple weeks? I record everything. I showed them. <laughs> Why would he do that? I don't know. Just because he's... He's bored. <laughs> he's an agent of chaos at Nintendo now. He, <laughs> every day Miyamoto shows up to work with a little bit more makeup. Until eventually, he's just full Joker. Who's cheering? Well, I mean, it's like modern day, like, sports games where they just have, like, canned cheering for social distancing purposes. I don't know why they have to put cardboard cutouts in the audience, though. There is, like, some gif that was going around of a baseball player giving a ball to a kid in the audience. Like, that was the joke. And then you... You know, you watch it, and he just drops the ball on the seat where there's a cardboard cutout of a child. People pay to put the cutouts there? Are you serious? They actually get the ball in the mail? <laughs> what is going on? I mean, it makes sense. That's one way to participate, or at least feel like you're there. I kind of get it. Weird solutions for a very weird time that we live in. In these trying times, Bank of America is here for you. <laughs> We here at Bank of America love social issue. That's why you should bank with us. Sign up now and get three free cardboard cutouts at baseball game of choice. We support local baseball team just as much as you do. God bless. Unless you don't believe in God, in which case, universe bless. I don't believe in the universe, says someone in chat. I want- there, there are people that, that don't believe in the universe. That doesn't strike me as that weird. The reason I use Bank of America as an example is the R.E.M. song, Exhuming McCarthy. It's a lyric. And, uh... Just immediately is like the first thing I think about. Oh! Chat, I should probably just stop now, right?
Oh, wait a second. I think I accidentally... Oh, no. I'm continuing. Oh, no. That was an accident. made a horrible mistake. Oh! Yep. Boned. Absolutely fucking boned. Audio warble still happening. I saw the weege, the, the steamy weege. Yeah, have you ever given someone a steamy weege? Luigi. Look. Uh. Mm. Luigi. Oh dear, sweet Luigi. This still isn't the right key. Luigi acquired. It's now just Mario and Luigi series. What if we just keep Luigi for the rest of the game? That's fine, right? It was folded here by my brother. He's actually a skilled origami craftsman, you know. He folded me so well that I came to life. That's why I can talk and float and talk and dance and talk. <laughs> oh, wait a minute. Your brother folded you to life, but he's also origami? So, who folded him? This is like, the great question of... ...our existence, Luigi. Stapler is next. Mr. Lumberg, I believe you took my stapler. Remember when stapler was a big meme? Weird. No? From the movie Office Space? No? I believe- I believe you have my stapler. No? Alright then. Hit me! Oh, God, yes! I'm guessing he completed you after that, Olivia. It seems he also ran off and with my best origami-making tools. Hey, excuse me, uh, your origami-ness, but uh, why did you fold Ali in the first place? I had intended for him to be a part of the origami castle I was building for the origami festival. Both Ali and Origami King... Both Ali, the origami king, and his sister Olivia were to sit up top as the finishing touches. I don't get to celebrate my craft very often, so... I might have gone a bit overboard. Man, some big info dump. Oh, that's so neat. Okay, Mario, let's get going. Say hee hee, you coward. Hee hee. Ah! Excuse me. I don't know why chat is... Oh, because hee hee. I get it. I see. That was a very loud... Ah! It took booty... Two minutes to figure this puzzle out. I don't understand why this guy is so stupid. I, 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 I cannot. I figure puzzle out immediately. I don't get it. I've seen things you wouldn't believe. Did we really just get a Blade Runner reference in Paper Mario Origami King? Because that makes me very happy. Welcome, travelers. You have done well acquiring the diamond key, but your trials are just beginning. Here, you shall undergo the three trials of power, wisdom and courage. Okay, now it's just Zelda again. For each trial that you complete, you'll be awarded an orb. You may enter the temples in any order you choose. Now. Go forth and on your orbs. Got luck. Putin, I do not know this puzzle. If that's the case, let's hurry inside. I want to see how cool this one looks. Eh? Hey? hey? <laughs> no laugh, huh? At least the statues thought my ice joke was funny. 
Well, that's like... Yeah, that's my kind of joke. I make jokes like that. And then chat is Mario. Chat's just like, oh yeah! Shovel that fucking hot garbage directly into my mouth! I give you money for this! I give you money for this! I don't know how to solve this baby puzzle. Oh, that works. Holy shit. I feel like I have a thousand year brain. That wasn't the solution. There is also a non-stupid solution to that puzzle. Solution was breaking only some rocks. I like brute force. Bunga. Bunga. Me saw puzzle by hit wall. My brain needed to go... Of course, every time I do that, someone posts a cleat. It's just weird that we got used to cleat. What the fuck is wrong with us? There's now... There will now be people being like, what's a cleat? My, ch my poor child. Please, ask not questions you wish not know the answer to. It's a sports shoe. That's correct, it is a sports shoe. What the fuck did I just... I was like, oh, I have one more move. It befuddles me, so... Take my money, Toad, please. I need time to think. I can't figure it out. I can't figure it out. Slide the single one back one. What, what, no, what now? If only you could see me hanging my head in shame. All that and I didn't even kill them. Someone said chat is really mean tonight, isn't it? Have you been here other nights? Vinny, am I your enemy? You still haven't unbanned me. How are you typing in chat? This, this dude found a way around bans. <laughs> That's astounding, well done. Oh yeah, one damage! Must freeze, boss. Or must reverse freeze on boss. I realized what I said. I, it echoed in my head. Melt? That's the word. I thought it was reverse freeze. <laughs> That's so cool. Oh shit, it comes back. Fuck that. Not in the same turn. Oh wait, I on. I forgot about that. Oh, that's cool. What am I- what, Did I not see the on? Today is a low brain day. What? Mario, you can't move on to that? I don't understand. Mario's the jump man. Oh, 
Holy shit. Oh my god. My headphones fell off. Piss off, bear. Yeah, it's like I discovered a new smell. Oh no, it's only the smells. A new color, yes, yes. Color, uh, yes. Perfect landing. See, these statues loved it. What a great audience. It was a great, great audience tonight, huh? So, Smadam, you working on Jack and Jill too? The anchor boy? Dusty McGuffin? What's your new movie, Adam? Well, you know, it's a great audience. And we've got the uh, piped in through the speakers. Chad, have you ever, like, when you were a kid, did you ever throw hot water balloons at your friends and siblings? No? Oh, it was so fun. You fill it up with scorching hot water that could burn the flesh off of their face. And then you just throw it at them. And then you go to juvie for 15 years. Well into your adulthood. Someone said, did that happen? You're gonna make your own decision on whether or not that happened. I'm not here to tell you if it did. Yeah. <laughs> you conquered the trial of power. This victory shall now be celebrated. What a bunch of jokers! You know, they could have just not, like, added any of that. They could have just had congratulates as the message, and that would have been enough. But they went, and they animated a bunch of toads. Miyamoto forced them. Watashi wa... Agent of Chaos Wa. I don't- I don't know what I just said. But, I think it's, um, yeah, he- he shows up in the Joker makeup, and he's just like, You should make those, uh, toads dance. Make those toads dance! And then, like, Miyamoto-san, we've been working for three weeks straight with no break. And then they all go home, and Miyamoto just sits on the computer and does it himself. And then his smile grows, like the Grinch. Like, the thing about Miyamoto is he's an agent of chaos, but not in the same way the Joker is. He's, like, chaotic good. He just wants to see people smile and have fun. Except the workers. I don't know. <laughs> just being a jerk. I'm sure Miyamoto's a wonderful man, and I, I respect him and appreciate the smiles he's given me through his uh, chaotic actions over at Nintendo. Right? Isn't that nice? That's a good question. Second question. Every hill in Overlook Mountain has an equal number of uphill and downhill slopes. I don't know. I don't know! Lucky guess. And for the record, chat was like trolls. They were like true, false, true, false. It was Vinny, it was James. Vinny, it was not James. Sono bango wa... Uh, Miyamoto des. I probably said something. But bango wa? Does that mean anything? If <laughs> someone said I don't like this wee bullshit. I'm speaking fake Japanese. These are not real words. <laughs> chat is uh, of very many minds. You see, there's many people in chat, but I've noticed... Here's what I've noticed. I've noticed that there are many people who need me to watch anime. Vinny, you need to watch it. And then there's a lot of people who are like, I don't like weeb sauce. Which has been one of the, the more interesting... One of the more interesting, uh, contradictions. Of how I'm both a weeb, and I hate anime. It's been, it's been fun to watch that unfold. So what is, tell me, what does bungawa mean in Japanese then? If I spoke real words, what did I say? I said, uh, sono bunga wa Miyamoto san des bunga. <laughs> bunga 
is Miyamoto. Is what I said. <laughs> Chat, we figured out who Nobunga is. Okay, so Kawabunga wa. Ito my pantsu. How do you say shorts in J Japanese, Chat? Short, short wa? Pantsu? You're lying. I know what pantsu is. Chat just told me. Short, shortsu? It's a double word. I give up. Chat's going to. Uh, why are there so many people that are trying to get me to believe that pantsu is. Uh, never mind. Anyway, you actually said Bunga River is eat my panties. Very good. Did I win? I think I won. Um, it took people a bunch more tries than that in chat. Some some folks are saying that makes me feel good about myself a little bit. That's cool. Got that ego boost going after the ego destruction uh, about a half hour ago. Hooray, right, you're the most courageous hero I know, Mario. I know a more courageous hero. He's green. He's green. He wears a hat, he finds keys, and his name starts with an L. You guessed it, Link. Woman's very afraid of the size of her opening. Oh yeah, I'm gonna smash ancient, ancient pillars. This belongs in a museum. Bonk. Just sit open over there. No. What are you doing? What is that? What did you just take? An apple? What's it eating? Do you think it's tasty? I bet it's tasty. That was a dramatic line reading of Olivia from me. Vinny Sauce, age five. I wonder if Mario, like, needs to eat. Oh, he does. Pasta. In, in the show, it's always pasta. Always. With no sauce. Never mind, he eats. Cause like I was gonna say, does he even consume the mushrooms and fire flowers? Like, can you eat flowers like that? Well, again, from Mario's 35th... Here's what I got. So far, this is all we know that we have. It's Paper Mario and, and this horror show. Vinny, don't say depressing stuff. I know, you're here for the escapism. If you want depressing stuff, I guess you could just listen to my music. Vomit in the ball pit makes me cry every time. Tears of piss. Someone should make an extension for the stream that keeps a running tally of every time Vinny mentions his band during each stream. I think, um, probably less than you think. If you need a tally, you'd definitely, over a year, you'd probably hear it a, ten, ten or so times per month. You'd be better with, a, like, a Star Trek or Blade Runner counter, honestly. Vinny, what do you think of this game counter? Or Vinny, what do you think of Star Trek Lower Decks? That's a double shot. That goes on... two different lists. I need those coins! I don't give a shit! Oh, fuck. Vinny, why did you not get the huge heart? Vinny, why did you not get the huge heart counter? Every time Vinny says the... Boing! Someone named That's Right Jay in chat says, Vinny, what do you think about why you live in New York? I'm beginning to question my New York living decision lately, but, uh... <laughs> it's good, I like that. Good name, too. Anyone know of any cool places in New Jersey? My other favorite state that I pe take people on tours of virtually in Google Earth and Flight Simulator? Hey, I'm elevating here. Fucking tape. You Mario, I got a message from the boss. How about you come over here so I can give it to you? And you origami kid, be a good goyle and run back to Ollie. It's past your Betty Bye time, capiche? It really is an Italian tape. I got a grudge with things that rap over other things. You think I'm some kind of joke? Hey? You think I'm funny like a clown? Oh. Well, well, it's a choice. Hey, why were there so many panels hiding in that chest? Hey, don't go messing up my hard work. You get titty up, you know? Can't leave no evidence. I wonder if I should throw hands now. I'm trying it. I'm not looking at chat. I'm just gonna try it. Hit the tape dispenser on all four sides to smash the whole thing. 
fuck. It's already been destroyed. <sighs> Eat shit. Oh, fuck. Hey, I'm attacking over here! Hey, look at me! I'm on a roll! <laughs> oh my god. Not very intimidating. Except now they're stuck together and can't be ropa- uh, ropated. Rotated independently. What if I just use the hands to unravel the tape? That's my theory. Yes! Yes! Well... Well, shit. I have to turn it on first. I, I think I let this... Everything got taped up too much. Oh, no. I thought it was gonna go into the thing, it didn't. Okay. Go for fire or hand? You know what? I'm gonna go for the hand. Why didn't Mario go faster? Why didn't Mario go faster? I was shaking the controller like a fucking chimpanzee shaking a banana. That makes no sense, but I was... <sighs> Why do I keep reading chat about these fucking fire flowers? Why do I keep reading chat? You gotta avenge me. I'm... I'm... I forget about it. Forget about it is actually on a sign when you're leaving Brooklyn. It says, you're leaving Brooklyn, forget about it. Alright, we can reach the streamer now, Mario. You know what to do. You know what to do! Rip. So, I guess Mike and Jerma and other purple streamers. I don't know which one chat hasn't decided. But, um, I'm, I'm next. I'm the green streamer. Twitch itself. That's all of Twitch. Twitch chat. Twitch in general. Mike. Jerma. Jaundice. Oh yeah, the green streamer is a vine. If you think about it. It's like the beanstalk. It goes up. That's my name, Beanstalk. Finally. A Mario game that watches my streams. Miyamoto official in chat. Hello, Mario. No, he's not. There's no one named Miyamoto official in chat, even though someone will probably name themselves that now. Like, Miyamoto shows up in chat, tries to donate, so he, so he can, like, have a message. I think it's super cool that toads don't have hats, or anything unique about them. Haha. <laughs> By the way, eat Burger King. Why doesn't Mario just DMCA these streamers? He's very good at that. Nari, you're right. Just kind of trails off into the clouds. Should we try to see where it leads? So chat, green streamer is... A beanstalk slash vine that goes up into the sky. What's in the sky? Aliens. And I do trail off on tangents very frequently. Game knows. Paradise found? Oh yes, we, we found paradise. Do you know what that means? Because I don't, but I'm excited. It just sounds good. It's, yeah, it's like toad heaven. Watch it be a casino. Hey, look at that, Mario. It's a Super Marino toy. Toy? Super Marino? Not at all. This is a replica of the Spa Marino, a submarine we use to escort our guests to the Diamond Island Trials. I actually have quite a lot to say about it. Do you want to hear its fascinating history? Oh good, I love telling the story. So according to legend, our little Spa Marino was once stolen by the mythical Captain Tewr. Sort of ransom, he offered the sub back to King Shroomsies in exchange for the King's crown. Well, that didn't sit well with King Shroomsies, a major spa enthusiast and Shangri Spa's most generous tipper. He also liked being king. So King Shroomsies arranged to have Captain Toad uh, captured and frozen in a block of ice. What a story, right? 
What a story, Mario. Good lore. Okay, goodbye! If you collect stamps from each of our hot springs, we'll give you a special prize and a toad job. Everyone that was tabbed out playing a game or working on another, another project heard toad job and tabbed back in immediately. Like, wait, what? Did it say that? Time... Oh. Yeah, I get it now. Just gonna this out for a while. Don't mind me. Feels so good. This is what they meant by refreshing and renewing your mind and body. Bad news, Mario. I only care about hot springs now. Ah. That's what you get! Maybe we should ask someone like this groundskeeper. Excuse us, groundskeeper, can you help us? Mario, what are you doing here? Sometimes I forget you're a celebrity. Or do you actually know this groundskeeper? Groundskeeper? I'll have you know. Ah, it's not important. As Lord Bowser's number one, I have faced off against this meddling mustachioid marauder more times than I can count. You may have heard of me. I am known as Kamek. Sorry, I haven't heard of you, Mr. Kamek, but it's very impressive that you're Bowser's number one groundskeeper. No, that's not... I, I'm not... Uh, look, the work I do for Bowser... Uh, thank you. As Lord Bowser's number one... Groundskeeper, I have some important information for you. After escaping in the clown car, Lord Bowser returned to his castle where he awaited his command. Where I awaited his command. But just as he arrived, we were overwhelmed by folded soldiers. Bowser was captured. Uh, again. Having heroically secreted myself during the attack, I was ready to engage our enemy emergency protocol. Secreted? Secreted. Oh, I thought Kamek pissed himself. But the button I pressed shut off the airship's engines instead. It wasn't my fault! It's not my fault. The engines off Bowser's castle plunged straight into the Shangri Spa campus. <laughs> yeah. Right into our banquet hall. One must make reservation to drop a castle on our banquet hall. Do you have any idea how far out we're booked? Well, you heard the toad. Uh, this is the state of Lord Bowser's minions, castle, and life. There's no time for side quests. Nice setup. Nice. Yes! Here we are. Go right in, Mario. <laughs> what are you worried about? It's perfectly standard mouth door. Oh, these dudes. You don't see these dudes a whole lot in Mario games anymore. Well, that confirms it. There really is a lightning beast guarding the front door. I'm relieved it wasn't just my imagination. Uh, I suppose we don't have much of a chance against it from down here. Uh, those folded soldiers confiscated my flying broomstick. How will we get up there? Think, Kamek. Dad! The Mario Lego set I have uh, includes BJ, Bowser Jr. He's, he's in there. Oh, it's the young master, Bowser Jr. I've never been so happy to see Lord Bowser's devilish spawn come flying recklessly out of nowhere in his clown car. Because we might be able to use that very clown car to reach the cloud, you see? Oh, shit. Oh, my God. Canonically, that's it. That's the end of Bowser Jr. No! Those... Obsequious toads in the lobby handed me a pamphlet about the restrictive powers of the hot spring of purification. It's near the entrance. Big words. Obsequious. Quicious. Obsequious. Obsequious. Not loquacious. Obsequious. Here's the definition of obsequious. Obedient or attentive to an excessive or servile degree. Obsequious. Vinny, he's dying. He can wait. Bowser Jr. has been nothing but a pain in Mario's side for years. And now we're rushing to help him? We can bring him to the spot of feet. Game over. Bowser Jr. has died. Charge and Chuck is one of my f favorite... No, wait. No, no, no. I hate Charge and Chuck. Never mind. No, I fucking... Like, my least favorite Mario characters. I don't know why. I just really, really dislike them. I think maybe there was an incident when I was younger 
with Charge and Chuck? I don't know. It happened on stream. I just feel like I have these memories of, of Charge and Chuck being a real jerk. It was probably tubular. It might have been the tubular level. Yeah, in Mario World. I probably... They were also just really annoying enemies. Like, they charge at you, they take three hits to die. Uh, they're... they're just really... obsequious. You know? Ch charge and Chuck PTSD might be from Champion's Road. Even before that. Even before that. Oh yeah, no, here too! Oh yeah! Oh god, I remembered. Yep, Champion's Road. 61 deaths. That 61 is the- is 61 deaths. Isn't that nice? Charging Chuck is not a good time. When you know you're close, a simple jump or swing of your hammer should do the trick. I forget that there's hammer blocks. He just told me. Oh, I skipped through that. Vinny, you read it out loud? I mentally did not process that. If you're telling me I read that out loud, then my brain just went... Pfft. It turns out you can smooth your brain at any time. Oh, yeah. We're gonna run out the battery. Oh. My work is finally complete, so now what? I guess I could find a new hobby. Maybe I'll learn how to fold origami. Don't do that. Remember Chestnut Valley? Bobby kept rolling away because he was so round. He was really good at getting in trouble, wasn't he? Rip. Some good times with Bobbertson. We will miss him. The clam? Hey, Bitter. Uh, well, what say you go... ...down to the clam? Joe, are you alright? You don't sound good. I don't know what you're talking about. Peter. Does the original Paper Mario die each time he's faxed? Is it like the Star Trek transporters? It's... Did you ever see the movie The Prestige? With huge Jackman? It's like that. Yeah, the original Paper, like, and each time Mario gets faxed, the detail on his clothing and face just gets a little grainier and a little grainier, and eventually he'll just be a black and white, like, crust image of Mario. Vinny, what about Official Alex Kurtzman? He just graded you. Oh, uh, thanks, Official Alex Kurtzman. Um... If anyone would want to do me a favor in regards to Alex Kurtzman Official on Twitch, just go ahead and unsubscribe from CBS All Access, if you have it. You know, really, like, just help Star Trek out. What about Burger King Official? Burger King Official, yeah, you should definitely, uh, check out a different fast food place. In fact, just make your own burgers if you can. There's better fast food burgers available, I, I know that. I've been there. I've been to some fast food places that have decent burger. I'm not gonna name any names because I was not donated to. Five dollars donation from Wendy's Official. Ah, oh, fuck, I named the name. Yeah, Wendy's just shows up on Twitch, shows up in my chat. What up, Scro? I'm gonna gift you five subs. You want a Frosty? My nugget? I'm like, uh, Wendy's, can you please stop talking like this? What if I told you that Wendy's on Twitter is not just one guy? Or one Wendy? or one person, and it's in fact, like, a team of 30 think tank, like, board college students that are helping Wendy's figure out how to appeal to the market. We're selling a one-of-a-kind item for just 10,000 coins. Will you buy it and help our cause? No. Kamek defending Mario. Careful, I hear a lot more screaming than you'd expect at a hot spring. Oh, shit! What's wrong with Mario's face, said Bowser Jr. Heaven music. Fuck, what am I doing wrong? I don't know how to do this. Uh, shit. Here I go. Clown car, bow! Oh, bow? I don't want to take our chances with the cloud until he's back to full strength. Come on, let's glow! Let's go, rather, not glow! We could glow from radioactive... wastes. We could go in there next! Let's get these baths over with so I can fight someone already! Is Olivia alive? Did you fix it? I still hear screaming, but I'm pretty sure it's just in my own head. That's a... a that's a really dark thing that that shy guy just said. Fine. 
So, okay, I don't buy it. Bowser Jr. says I'm cheap. I do buy it. Bowser Jr. says I'm rich. Bowser Jr. is Twitch chat. Stamp. It's just fucking Goombas, and I... Oh. Someone just said stamp in the place where you were. Here's the article. I want to see what this article is. Nintendo plans to upgrade Switch console major games for 2021. Bloomberg? Specification have yet to be finalized, though Kyoto-based company has looked into including more computing power. W why are they reporting on this? There's there's no announcement from Nintendo, is there? Is this anywhere near an accurate... Like, what what the hell? It's just speculation. Is this what happens what, with news these days, where there's no source, and it's just speculation made to seem like it's proper news? Because they didn't... That article did not say, it appears that Nintendo is working on a new thing. There is some speculation that Nintendo may be working on a new model. The way they worded it was, Nintendo has a new model of Switch coming out next year, with a new strong software lineup. I got something real good for you, it's a max up heart. It's yours for 10k coins. Yeah? Did I get scammed? Could I have, like... Could I have bargained? Hello, this is the Toad Helpline. How can we help you? Oh, right. Okay, that makes sense. I don't know how I didn't see that earlier. Or as Captain Lou said, It's a dollar thirty-five for every minute! And thirty-five cents after that. You can get wrestling news! Hey! I'm Captain Lou Albano talking to you from Wrestling Central. I've been involved in wrestling for thirty-five years. Nobody, but nobody knows wrestling like me. So, why does Wrestling Central look like someone's basement from the 70s? Vince McMahon does not want to pony up that cash, huh? This motherfucking toad is a flat piece of paper on a trophy stand for 24,000 coins. Even with the card, I'm gonna go full Vince McMahon here. Very expensive. Douglas, you wanna take a hot spring bath? Oh, hmm. Looks like we have a choice to make. I think we should go this way. Call it my origami sense. Is that so? Well, I think we should go this way. Call it Kamek Sense. Well, I'm not used to people listening to me, so I'll give you another chance to back out. Are you sure? No. Do you trust me, Mario? No. Okay, bye-bye. A wise decision. Wait, this doesn't feel right. I've never had anyone take my advice out right now. I'm nervous. Did you guys hear that? Was it just my imagination? I say left, we go right. AI Dungeon really hurt my feelings last night, chat. It was saying mean things to me. Yeah, I can't believe God, or rather the, the being that created God, was someone from my YouTube comments. I don't think that was enough coinage for Toads to rotate. It's not. Am I overthinking it? I don't see it. Just rotate the outer. No, I'm not- no. No. 46 seconds. Eat my coins. So that was, um, more- okay, I thought I had more moves. I will never know the puzzle. I will never know the solution until the next time this puzzle occurs. <laughs> Yet again, I thought I had more moves than I did. Chat, expect extra smooth tonight after the Blade Runner commentary and kill it with fire. And now this. It's- we're gonna be smoothing nicely. Vinny, where did you first hear the smooth brain, uh, thing? I thought I made it up. But, there have been several things that I thought I made up that were subconsciously implanted in my brain by chat. And... 
others that were just like around for like 10 years. I thought free real estate was something I made up and it turns out it was a Tim and Eric bit that chat was saying a lot and I thought that I said it because my memory's garbage. I thought chat just really enjoyed the cleverness of me saying it's free real estate. Vinny, it's koalas. Koalas have smooth brains and are dumb. It started as dry brain. Oh, right, 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 it was dry brain. Because when there's no fluid in the brain, it's so dry you can't think properly. Because it's not carrying the electric charges. And then that turned into smooth brain, perhaps at the behest of a chat member who knew about a smooth brain thing. But I am seeing smooth brain, like, a lot more outside of the vine saw circles, so I don't know what's- what's going on there. Maybe it was a thing already? It's pretty werewolves. It was already a meme? I figured. Yeah, after free real estate, I have no grand illusions that I've created much of anything of use, uh, so I'm not too bar bothered about that. I'm not too arsed. What the fuck? Wait, whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, I overthought it again. Like, I'm just pissed at myself that I don't see these things. Yeah. Nice boots, asshole. Someone in chat just said perfect brain sphere. I think if I was ever, like, to make a movie, I would make, like, throwback weird body horror movies like Cronenberg did in the 80s. Well, more in the 80s, but... Like, that would be- I would make the man whose brain was smooth. And it would be, like, the brain sphere. That's a good concept. Oh no. <laughs> oh no, the bees! <laughs> okay, so we gotta- we gotta figure this out. Alright, so, uh... Beef that brain. Whack. Whack. I can't say whack without squinting my eyes. Like Hannibal does. I, I have to. <laughs> Survived my best boot. Best boot goofin'. Imagine my surprise when I realized I didn't come up with new boot goofin'. Okay, now that I know I didn't come up with. It makes- there's, like, no chance a human being could come up with that phrase outside of Reno 911. Oh my god. Hey, you're probably wondering how I got here. What's Quibbly? Is that a toothbrush? Chat, you can watch the new season of Reno 911 on your toothbrush. And that's why I couldn't figure it out, because in my brain, there's no way to do this without rotating. Wait, what? Wait, 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 wait. What? Vinny, you just had it. What did I had? I didn't see that. Nope. You want the hottest wrestling tips? I'm at Wrestling HQ. Now, now, young master, you, we mustn't simply guess. We should listen to Kamek, who has been correct every time so far. Lord Bowser always does the opposite of what I say, and you always defeat him. It's not a coincidence. You must follow me. I am vindicated! I mean, let's go. Olivia's like, I get it. Nice fucking choice, Kamek! Vinny, you missed it. The other options literally kill you. Oh, cool. If you chose someone else, you would have died? What the fuck, Paper Mario? I simply rejected the emotional choice. You two made in favor of ones made using bloodless logic. But, in a way, doesn't that mean I was making the right choice every time? You wouldn't have known which way to go if I hadn't made the wrong choice first. Olivia, please. Oh. No! Yeah! Time for bad touch long arm creep Mario. Okay. Now, we're gonna take a piece. Mario, what is this educational program? This is a Mario Party Training! Woohoo! Nintendo was later sued for millions in damage. People grow up as adults pissing in pipes because Mario taught them to pee in a piranha plant pipe. Uh -huh. 
You know what's not so nice? When Kamek leaves Mario's side to run. And Mario may now get killed by, uh, big... Big boot. What's the big idea running away like that? You could have warned us at least. Ah, uh, sorry about that. As I said earlier, timely retreats have been a key to my success. <laughs> Great, now Olivia retreats as well. Mental. Probably wondering why I never looked up, huh? Well, it's easier said than done with a neck like this, let me tell ya. What neck? Oh, yeah! Hopefully Olivia doesn't drown this time. Dad has never taken a bath, and he's doing just fine! That's not true, Mario Sunshine. False. Vinny, that was soup. Wait, that was soup? Was it really? Oh, yeah, I guess it was soup. Chad, have you ever seen Super Mario Soup? Let me show you. Three days. Super Mario! Super! I believe Mario is broken made that. I hope I'm getting that right. Dude, why? <laughs> the dude why Buzzy Beetle is my favorite character in this game. Spring of Rainbows, VIP. I thought it was gonna be like, crayons. It's no mere piece of paper, friend. That is a VIP pass to our most exclusive hot spring. The Spring of Rainbows. Someone said, Vin, you gotta come to my cousin's spa. Spa Rainbow. Ava Mendez will be there. Tia Leone. Annette O'Toole. Vin. Betty White will be there. Vin, Adina Menzel. I'm sorry, who is that? You don't know who Adina Menzel is? What was it? Adele Dazim? <laughs> That's what John Travolta called her. <laughs> I forgot about that! Oh my god! And now, the wickedly talented... Adele Dazim. I can't believe... I just can't believe that he did that with a straight fit. Well, he didn't... Listen, he panicked. He forgot the name of the person. I forget the name of things all the time. There's no easy way to make a joke about it, either. Follow the signs and watch out for the str the steam. Watch out for the stream. Could these toads maybe streamline... ...some of this a little bit? Or steamline it? The wickedly talented... ...Videl Vasim. That's me. That John Travolta forgot my name. He, he read Vinny Vine Sauce on the cue card, and he remembered it as Videl Vasim. It's just, you can tell, like, his brain is working as hard as mine is when it tries to rotate baby butt puzzle games. I mean, this is the guy from Battlefield Earth, so you know he can commit to a role. With endless options for renewal! Endless options for renewal! Chad, there's a thing I need to do right now, hang on. I'm compelled. Patterson compelled. Endless, endless options, options for renewal! For renewal. With, endless With endless options, options, options for, renewal. for renewal! Too fast. Too fast. Too fast. Too fast. Check. 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 Whoa. 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 Chad. Chad. What's going on? What's going on? I can't do it. I can't do it. I can't. I can't. Help. 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 Please help. Please help. I can't do it. I can't do it. With endless options for renewal. With endless options for renewal. With endless options for renewal. Endless for renewal. Close enough. Close enough. Oh no! It should just be insta game over. Your save file gets set back. I was gonna say insta save wipe, but that's not nearly as. It's just it's an easy obvious joke, but I think if it. Oh yes! If it set you back to, like, a previous save point randomly just to fuck with you, that would be cool. That actually would be really good for, like, 
an Eternal Darkness sequel. Yes. Mario, why are you so bad at this? Luigi, I'm wearing my coin gloves. Yeah, me too, bro. We've always been wearing the coin gloves. That's what these gloves are, bro. Vinny was right. It's not a stupid idea. It's a good idea. If only Master Bowser would listen to my ideas. Hopefully not, because then Mario would lose every time. It's time for... Sorry, guys. Finish last. The fuck? Japarity. The bath math game will test your memory and your math skills. Good luck. My two worst categories of humanity. One, two, three. Thirteen. Seventeen. It, it, it's... It, uh, oh, no. What is this doing to me? I don't know if it's 21 or 22. Well, thank God for that. Thanks, chat. 50 points. Well, as you know, the fisheye is worth 50 points. That's worth 10 points. Oh no, more bath math. Oh no. I think it was 13. I think it was, was it 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7? Was it 7 or 9 that jumped? Oh, it was 7. I don't know. I can't even get ha uh, help from chat on this one. Because chat doesn't even fucking know. Chat, how do I do this? The guy who hates backseat gaming asking for help. How the turntables. No, I, I- when I ask for help, I like to have help. Backseat gaming, I feel, is more unasked for. I do ask for help a lot. Are you new? Well, this is good. The- the 50-point version would be, like, stomach ulcer inducing. Like, that's a stomach ulcer explosion. Vinny Coop won. No, because it said number one at the top lane. Someone in chat just said, You- congratulations, you just won the race. Here's a concussion. That's your prize. We're gonna play a tune that I know you've heard before. Ah, but we've replaced one key lyric with a question mark symbol. So you'll have to remember what word is missing, and then... You'll guide your special assistant Olivia to the correct button! Oh no. There. Fire's burning in my chest now. It's... Call your name. I want to see you in the pulp now. Let's all rise up and join together. Uh, um, it's it's not insane. It's not. It's it it, it it's it's a flame. I'm gonna hit the button, Mario. I hope you're right. Thanks, chat. You fucking shite. I didn't even know this kind of existed before this fucking game. I remember, I uh, say it with me now. It's time for... Uh, guys, please last! I guess this is a color splash. I'll take the special. Today's special coming right up. Perto. Wait, is this a... Is this one of them adult entertainment clubs? Whoa. Whoa, what are these? Oh. No. Chad, I'm a little perturbed. I'm mildly perturbed. It's quite good. Yo, 
What the chat? That that is not a bit. That was not a bit. What the fuck? Okay, so here's the thing. Normally, my splitter is on the floor, right? If my foot hits it, yeah, it, it would maybe do that. I did not move. That's the most perfect timing of something like that I've seen in a long time. Um, it was an electric surge in the video game, but pounced. I, yeah, I thought the game crashed. I was like, the fuck? What was his name? Prince Peasley crashed my game that one time. Okay, rip boss. Hey, don't forget about saving my dad. Mm. No. I can't believe they've done this. Oh, this is cool. <laughs> oh, I can actually, like, fight them? Wait, there, there's friendlies here now. Oh, I don't like that, chat. So I have a lot of legendary boot, so I'm just gonna use those now. Bitch! Do you know what happened there, chat? I thought I was gonna kick the turtle at the, the spike top. Y yes <laughs> the fuck is wrong with Bowser in this photo? Oh, it's a side view. I thought... Chat, I thought that that was a front view and Bowser was a Cyclops. This is a lovely room of death. Oh. 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 The old steamy weege. That's the, the name of the move. Oh. Yeah. Oh, yes! This smells amazing! Makes me want to cook a pizza or a pasta. Or maybe a pizza pasta. Wait, that's me. It's a mushroom. And Luigi is talking about pizza pasta. If you or anyone you know were a writer for this game, please email me at this web zone. Yeah. Yes! What I want to know what why the slippery weege was like going mental over a mushroom. Oh no, Kamek is dead. Oh you you son of a bitch. Oh no! Fuck. Oh, what have I done? No, I didn't mean oh I wanted to fight, not that. No! Mario, no! It's okay. No, it's not okay! Mario ellipses. No, I have to blame Mario. That was definitely Mario's fault, not not the player. He who control Mario. I could have done that better. I could have done all of this fight better so far, but that's okay, I'm learning. Wah! Could this be that legendary form of hand-to-hand -hand combat? Stony Sheedy Cuddy? Rock, paper, scissors. Oh, oh. Well, that has a much better ring to it. It's really shitty of you to say that, Olivia. I think I just formulated a theory just now. No, my theory is bad, by the way, chat. It's incorrect. Incorrect theory. Uh, Alright, so I'll say, I, I thought for a second there that Olivia might have been Peach folded up into origami. And then I remember that's not the case. I was like, oh, what a twist that would be! Oh, this is a nice... Bowser's castle! Oh yes! Look out! I get credit for that. I am scissors. Is that Mario? Where am I? I'm hungry. Hey, stop touching my face. Who didn't brush their teeth? Ooh, is that a tongue? This is a Cronenberg monster in Paper Mario's universe. Tetsuo Canada, Tetsuo Canada. Vinny, what the fuck? Where the fuck is Tetsuo Canada? I can't find it anywhere. Double check, it's probably somewhere on Nova Scotia. No, 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 check Nova Scotia. Ah, 
I am not looking forward to this one. Probably don't want to break that cover. Oh, fuck. We're flipping. All right, enough. It was fun while it lasted, but your feeble attacks have grown tiresome. Let's cut to the climax. Ha-ha! <laughs> Damn. It's a fucking really epic scene. Ah, oh, you son of a bitch. I'm readying my ultimate attack. You won't stand a chance. Oh, fuck. All of my money you can have, Toads. That was a waste of time! And money! Guarding is useless. This is the end for you, you flat fiends. Farewell! I don't know which elemental to use. Chat. Which one is ice? The, the bear? Which one's a bear? <laughs> oh, the bear was the bear. Gotcha. Motherfucker. Fuck you, scissors. That could have been really bad, because those couple of ultimate attacks were one-hit KOs. So that almost was terrible. If you break the sheath early, the entire fight turns into dodging the one-hit kill move every turn. I did that by accident, and honestly, the most fun fight in the entire game. Okay. Goodbye, chat. Origami girl. You didn't think we were gonna let you do that alone, did you? Don't you know how this works? Mario needs to rescue the princess, and I need to find Ali and punchify his face for making me like this. But there is one thing you'll need to do. Get me down already! Is Bowser a pizza box? Mario, origami girl, I must prepare a few things. Follow me to the supply closet. It's on the floor first. Oh, it's on the first floor, wow. That was some interesting dyslex dyslexia. Listexia. Do something with the pillars and hurry up with it. Hello, Mario. Checking in for duty, ma'am. Bobby? Is that you? How? Uh, what's happening? Am I seeing things? How are there so many Bobbies? It's the Final Fantasy IX Black Mage plot. Cool. How, how does this big hunk of junk fly, anyway? I mean, what a glorious, majestic vehicle. I, I like that the Coopers are following. Why, why don't they let these poor Coopers just, like, rest on the ship? Uh, this is amazing. I can't believe this heavy boat can fly through the air. Exactly my thoughts, too. <laughs> I'm glad you like it. They tell me it's the most powerful and least efficient vehicle ever produced. <laughs> it's just so silly. It's kind of cool, too, like, seeing a big, like, air battle rendered like this is, is kind of neat. Mario, you want to make yourself useful for once? Follow me! Okay! That reminds me, this reminds me that UN Squadron needs to be in my top 100. 
You win Squadron and Splatoon 2. That means that I have to knock one off. Now, I know that sounded weird and out of context. I have to knock one of my games off of my list. Oh my god. That sound effect. I did eat. Eat. Um, hi everybody from Joel's stream. I'd like to let you know that this is the very end of Paper Mario, the Origami King. Meaning... Big spoilers! Big! Enemy off the port side, it's coming straight for us! It's... It really is a Star Destroyer. Oh, I'm a sweaty! I'm a smell, not showered in weeks! The world's on fire- yes. Oh no. Kamek. Don't do it. Some really good fucking music here. Just a cool set piece in general. Oh no, quintuple Kamek. This is fine. I have no problems with this event. That'll put us right on the doorstep of Peach's castle! Who says no?! <laughs> it's a very Bowser thing to say, who says no. Cool. Oh, that's good. Good thing the floor was paper. <laughs> oh, this is the final warp. Just, chat, just think if Mario had a pair of scissors or a razor blade. He could have cut that paper off of the pipe and skipped the whole game and just warped straight here. I'll tell you what, chat. Ah, just want to fly. Incredible timing, Luigi. We're so glad to see you. Hello, Mario. I mean... Wait, hang on a minute. You suck. I'm a sorry, bro. You suck. I'm a sorry, bro. Okay, that fucking hurts. <laughs> Luigi wins by doing absolutely nothing. That is correct. Come stay with us, Mario. Forever and ever and ever. Princess, I'm a coming. Oh my fucking god, really? Let's just go to Babom Battlefield instead. It won't open, huh? But they didn't even put anything on the other side. Bah, patch! And the rest of the castle, you cowards. Wait a minute, is that a meta joke? That's really good. Nope, no Babom no Battlefield, just Toad. They, they took Babom Battlefield, holy shit. Oh wow, okay. Uh... Cube. Could I have rescued Luigi, or is it now much too late, and canonically, is Luigi dead again? Olivia... ...was actually rolled from the Nintendo Power... ...guide for this game. That's the origami that she... she was. That was the paper. She was rolled. Uh, maybe not the right choice of word. Folded, yeah, not not rolled. You know, she she's not a blunt. Vinny, how do you know? Well, not yet, at least. That's in Conquer's Bad Origami Day. Very bad idea. Wow, that was half of my health. This music is. It's really good. Oh, I do have an invisibility suit that I've only used nuns. Wait a minute, wait a minute, please, wait a minute. What is this now? <laughs> what is... what? What? No, I just I don't know. This is too stupid. My poor brain. I lament its loss. Oh! 
Grab, use the fingers. Okay, get ready to move your pingors. Sona Chat said T O D E actually makes me laugh. What spelling toad incorrectly on purpose, you you heathen? I like it too, actually. Because it, it almost looks like the word chode. It's a good, I'm gonna have all these a mushroom. Vinny, you're getting killed by fortune things. Oh god, they are the fortune things! There is always the one kid in class who would make it, and it would, like... Ha everyone would have to learn how to make it afterwards. Someone in chat said, I was the kid who made the vulgar fortune tellers. That was you, huh? I may not know you personally, but I know you. And I know your chat messages, too. All of them. I'm psychic. Mod tools? No, 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 no. Psychic powers. Vinny, what number am I thinking? 11 Wasn't that Bilbo's, uh, birthday? 111th birthday? Oh my god, I thought Bilbo was another one of your names for a second. I'm surprised it hasn't become that already. I really like this song. Oh my god, it's so good! Same composers that do the Fire Emblem games? That explains it. I don't know if that's true, that's what a chat member just said just now. Oh yeah, we're gonna go back in the fort! Butt plug. Now, people are saying in chat. Bunt cake. Bunt cake, please. Give me another 20 seconds or so. I got it. I got it, chat. I, I think I got it. Brick house. <laughs> Beanstalk. The Mayros. No, no, my may Mayron. This pipe feels like Japes. It's not Japes, it's just not a good pipe. Ho ho! Vinny, have you seen those vacuum suits where- Oh, nope, we're not doing that. The vacuum suits. Bing switch. Porticont, please. But then these don't work. What? Do da di da. You've earned the Battle King trophy. That's spelled T R O U G H. It's Olivia. Nintendo Plow. <laughs> Nintendo Plower is my favorite magazine. What the fuck else could you even do with paper? They've done stickers, they've done color splashing, they've done origami. Eat, burn. Paper fire. Cardboard caper. That's what I get for looking at chat. <clears throat> oh man, that's that's a lot of goombers. <laughs> yes! What the fuck? Is it, is it time? Whatever. Oh, okay, hey, Squall. Tired of trying to explain myself to fools. You leave me with no choice. I believe you have my paper. Bind them. That guitar is crunchy. <laughs> Did you see what the toad is saying? It's a dog? Uh, Mario stuck. Pinned down, can't move. So, that was a lot of staples. Reloading. Changing Meg! Oh no. Oh god. 
liquid hot staples. Check this out, chat. Full toad. Do you think that stapler's been on a clown's undergarments at any point? Does it still have staple? Yeah, it's still sta- no, uh, no, it's re- It's reloading! Okay. Okay, this is a lot of damage. Go, Toad. If you can't do it, no one can. It really is so cheap. It's so cheap. Wait, only a 50 heal? That's not enough heal. I- I got 200 before from the Toads. Okay. Okay. We need to finish this now. Yes! Get fucked! Uh, something came loose. Oh, this could be our chance to fix poor Bowser. Think about it, Bowser was in pain this entire time having a staple betwixt his body. <laughs> Can we even stop him now? Or is he already too powerful? Thank you, Mario. You're always there for me when I'm at my absolute flimsiest. Yoo-hoo! Oh, that was a little audio glitch! <laughs> Again! Why is there so much audio glitch tonight? Anyway, where's Princess Peach? Is she safe? Is she comfortable? Does she have something to read? Asking for a friend. Oh, the princess is right in front of you. Behold. Uh, what the fuck? Witness the thousand cranes technique. He who has the patience to fold one thousand origami cranes shall have any wish granted. I still don't understand what you've got against toads. <laughs> He, he is the audience. Of course I do. He's the whole reason I'm doing this. That fool disrespected the very paper I am made of. He scribbled all over me! That's what this is all about. <laughs> That's why you're doing this? You've seen one toad. You've seen them all. They're all the same to- Oh my god. Wow. It's actually- So, it's an in-game comment about how every toad is the- is the same and every Mario game has toads in it. Very good. Thank you, game. After I defeat you, I'll honor your paper by folding you into the very last crane. Shit. I will fulfill my dream. If you won't fold willingly, I shall bend you to my will by force. Just remember, I brought all of these toads with me, everywhere. Yes. Yeah, pluck those feathers. It's a good thing this boss only has one form, and and this will not be here, Olivia. Let me show you the true power of origami. Origami God. Okay, I want an origami Bowser now. <laughs> they should just like slap each other. Yes, exactly. Exactly. I like that Bowser's finally getting his due here. I'm glad he played such a pivotal role at the end of this game. No, I mean, it's just, it's nice that. Uh, I say it's nice that Bowser gets to be a Megazord and gets his revenge. My arms are getting tired! <laughs> you got beat by paper powerhouse! Eat gravity, you jerk! Curse you! Well, my arms are at least tired. I feel like I've accomplished something.
Oh, there's more. I will not allow this. I will crush you, all of you. Chat, many of you know that this is not something I'm particularly good at. This, this seems correct. Chat, this seems correct. Vinny, it's upside down. Oh, you're right, it is upside down. It's time to rotate! I was half a second away from solving that. Well, alright, maybe one full second away from solving that. Uh, wait, what, what, what am I doing? What am I doing? What have I done? Oh, blue is fucked up. Oh, God. Oh, no. Oh, blue is fucked up. Everything is fucked up. Oh! <laughs> Alright. I have to do this and then rotate. Alright, well, yeah, I, okay. I thought I could, like... <laughs> I was like, hey, this looks fucked up. I thought I could save time by just doing it like that, but that was completely wrong. Uh, that was good. Very nice. Thank you, eat dick. Well, now I definitely got it, chat. Let's just- don't worry about the climax and anti-climax. Just- just think about- think about how good it will be later. You know, with, without failure, how does one fully know what it is? It's it. But what is it? You remember the song. I was just playing. I was just joshing. You think I'll allow this? I'll make this magic circle as useless as scrap paper. You won't fuck you! Oh no! I pressed the A button too soon. I can't believe that. Yeah! Mario's turn. I was one A button press away. Big hammer. Big go hammer technique. Brother, please come to your senses. And Mario really just likes to solve problems with violence. In this game, I've learned that the best way to solve puzzles and problems is by hitting them with hammers. I'm sorry, brother. I had no choice. Oh, but you poor... your poor body is all crumpled now. Maybe I went too far. I was too proud. Too entitled. My heart was... blinced. My path was creased. I was... a mess. Wait, what's this? On your belly. Oh, that's to move. That's the cause of all this madness. The careless scrawl that Toad marked me with. Read it for me, will you? I must know what's written there. What words of gibberish mark this foolish body? Please, I could use one last laugh. Okay, um, let's see. Dearest Ollie, may you grow into a fair and kind king. It's not just a scribble. It's a very sweet message from the origami craftsman. He just wished you the best as a new king. <laughs> Please accept these 999 cranes and then fold my body into the 1,000th. When the last fold is complete, you will gain the ability to have any wish granted. I don't suppose it'll make up for everything I've done, but it's all I have left. I'm begging you, Olivia, do this for me. Brother! Oh, yes. Well done. With that, the technique is complete. 
You may make your wish, Olivia. Okay, my wish. My wish. Is for a Nintendo Direct. This 3rd of September. Thousandth Crane, grant me my wish. May all the origami folded by my brother be undone! Wait a minute. All except one, right? I wish for Bobby to come back. Wahoo. Oh my goodness. What are we all doing here? Princess Peach, you're back to your old self. Wahoo! Wait, we're missing someone. Where's uh, Olivia? Classic ending theme. Very nice. So every happy that everything's back to normal. Toad Town is bustling with an origami festival. Everyone's discovering the magic of origami and having fun. See, even, even every, like, Bowser's minions are getting along with the toads. That's nice. This won't last long. This piece. It's what all true warriors strive for, but, you know, Bowser's just gonna build another airship soon. His lust for revenge is, is too great. Luigi's got the boot now. Good for him, he's got a new car. Ah, Mario, Peach, come take a look. My masterpiece is finally finished. You see, it's a miniaturized origami castle, just like the one Ollie made. Okay. Okay, I'm sad. Gather around, everyone. It's time for the big finale. To all the origami... Thank you. Yeah. Paper lanterns. It was a good video game. There were ways it could have been better, and I talked about those plenty during this playthrough. There are some things that would have brought it a little closer to what I think the, the Paper Mario fans would have wanted, but if you take it for what it is, it was charming. I really fucked up a lot of those puzzles. But yeah, the presentation here is really nice. It's a, it's good uh, visuals, good, good, excellent music. Um, the story was surprisingly, like, sad. And I like that the partners were kind of back, even if they weren't back for the whole game. Like, they were just partners per area. The writing was, um... was really funny at times, and otherwise just, like, a lot of fourth wall breaks and quips. Again, this isn't Final Fantasy... <laughs> this isn't Final Fantasy VII, or VI, or anything like that. It's just Paper Mario. It's... it's... lighthearted. But, um, pretty good. I like that the combat was broken up by, like, actual real-time, like, hammer combat. I enjoyed that some sometimes, when it wasn't just the, um, the ring battles. I- I didn't really love the, um, the lack of- we've talked about this plenty, but, like, the, the lack of character, um, development, like, leveling up and getting new armor and weapons and all that stuff. Like, I, I guess I would have preferred that, getting new moves. 
but it's still a little bit more RPG than I was expecting. Um, this section of the game was great. I, I liked all the areas. I liked the nighttime desert a lot. I liked this a lot, the Wind Waker shit. It was just, uh, yeah, it, it's a game that starts out a little bit okay, and then it just gets better and better. And I'm always a fan of Bowser becoming a friend. So, that was handled well. Kamek becoming a partner was nice, too. So yeah, yeah, it's pretty good. I haven't played Sticker Star or Color Splash, but I would imagine... Of those three, of this, plus those, those two, uh, this seems to be the best one, according to a lot of fans. In terms of my rankings, I would still say Thousand Year Door is my favorite. Followed by the original. And then Super Paper Mario... This is just near Super Paper Mario for me. Like, it's right there. I liked Super Paper Mario, I think it was great. It had a lot of cool shit going for it, but it also had some... some stuff that held it back, same as this. But I'm, I'm glad that I played this. I'm glad I streamed it. I was thinking about, like, oh, is this gonna be good? And... I'm very pleased to have streamed a game that ended up being mostly satisfying and, and funny, and chat liked it. Yeah, it's pretty good. So here's the bonus 100% scene. Damn, it should have been like the end of Inception. You know, like it should have just like, like Olivia's uh, paper mache should have vibrated like one pixel and people could have analyzed that forever. Um, Vinny, would you recommend this game? I think if you, I would recommend it to most people. I would still say watch a little bit of it. You know, determine whether or not you want to do that battle system. If you liked other Paper Mario games, you might like this one. If you're just looking for another game on the Switch that is kind of good, kind of chunky in terms of gameplay length, I think you'll enjoy this. I'd mostly recommend it, sure. It's like an 8 out of 10 type game for me, you know what I mean? Like, it's in that range of, of if I had to give it a number score, which I don't usually like to do. But it's like in, in there, somewhere around there, depending on, you know, person to person. Um, but for me, it's about an 8 out of 10, and... It wasn't that any part of it was- was bad, like, it just... didn't, um, grip me like Thousand Year Door did, I guess. But that's a great score. This isn't the IGN scale, which again, Crystal Chronicles 3 out of 10, yeesh. I thought they didn't give below 5s, but, um... For me, an 8 out of a 10 is, like, a very, very good game. So, again, I'm glad I played it. And I'm, I'm happy that, uh, you were all here to watch it with me. This was a good surprise. We didn't even know this game existed until, you know, a couple months before it came out. And... Yeah, I'm, I'm happy it exists. Hello, Mario.